What do you think that thing is? And how the hell is it going to work? <laughs> Help you today, Clive. Come to claim your just desserts. Here you are. All done. Test, test. Very good. I guess that works. But, for the moment, I have the sound on my TV right now, so I'm gonna fix that. Put it to my headset. There. Okay. Hello, everybody. How's, how's life? <laughs> What's going on? Um. Besides my cold and stuff, family recently had a a sad event happen. My uncle, he was a passenger in an experimental plane that was flown by a good friend of his, and they they crashed. They they had an emergency landing in a pond or something down in Georgia, and the pilot, thus far as um, okay, he's still critical, I think, but my uncle passed away a couple days ago, so two people on a, a plane, one, my uncle was the one who didn't make it, so my family's, like, reeling with that, <coughs> with that news. It's my mom's younger brother. I think... I want to say he's the youngest of four. So there's my older uncle, my mom, my aunt, and then my younger uncle. So I know him more of like just growing up and going down to grandpa's house and stuff because they lived right next door to each other. So I have like a ton of fun memories of him as a kid. Um, ever since I moved to Japan though, it's it's really difficult to stay in contact or just to, to meet people. So like, I think the last time I saw him was when I went back home in 2016 when my dad died. And so he came up and it was nice to see him. And <coughs> so it's pretty sad. A lot of the news coverage, too, that I've been finding 
about it has his name wrong. I'm like, dude, how? <laughs> don't get his name wrong. You're a reporter. <laughs> Do your job and spell it correctly. Thank you. Like, that's super important, don't you think? To get the person's name correct. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's one letter difference, but still, that that makes a huge difference, don't you think? <laughs> anyway, you, you can tell my voice is weird. I haven't talked and I haven't spoken in, like, the past four days. <laughs> I can't speak. Oh, so Joshua is, has concern for Jill. Oh my god. I chopped them up there. The loss of sheep. Oh, so that's why he was pissed. Not a whole doll. That's, see, that's why he was pissed. If Joshua was worried about Jill, I should go and speak with him. <laughs> Why speak with Joshua? <laughs> oh. I'm like, what? Shouldn't you be talking to Jill, not Joshua? <laughs> That's the wrong J name. <laughs> there are a lot of people with J's. Say what you will. Yo, to. Although it's a different pronunciation. What? Am I lost? I'm lost. I went the wrong way. What? Oh man, my brain. Holy cow, my brain. Oh, boy. Joshua. Oh. I read your message. You're right. Jill is different. I don't think I'd realized how different, but since we've returned from Drake's spine, I've felt it more and more. I suppose it's not hard to imagine why. She doesn't think she belongs anymore. And that's why we need to remind her she is still one of us. To let her know that we still need her. Oh, is this gonna be oh, come on. You if this doesn't give us a, a smooch chance. How to do that. When last we were truly close, we were but children. <coughs> of course. Do you remember the time we accompanied Father on his annual tour of the duchy? And Jill and I broke from the procession to ride up Man's Hill. Uh-oh! <laughs> I remember. It was that sounds kind of bad. Us to join him. Let's ride up Man's Hill, get it? <laughs> they want to ride up my Man's Hill? <laughs> The peak is kind of steep right, right here. <laughs> a thunderstorm forced us to take Watch your step. of oaks before we'd even made it halfway there. It was the Lord Commander who finally found us, and needless to say... Was that an awkward line? He was none too pleased. Then it seems you and Jill have unfinished business. Oh. What do you say? Oh. Man's Hill. It's not that <laughs> far. <laughs> it's not that far. <laughs> it's not that high. Oh, I suspect it is also much changed. Little or is in it? southern Rosaria remains as it was when we were children. <laughs> it's I'm rather I should go and scout the area Never for mind. bandits. I forgot. Uh, I'm saying we <clears throat> should first go and see if there are actually still any snow daisies left. <laughs> what would you do without me, Clive? Oh, Joshua. Oh, boy. Boy. So oh, we're going to go there first. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, I love Joshua so much. What would you do without me? Oh, boy. You gotta scope the place out first before bringing a date. <laughs> oh, God. <clears throat> I do remember this location, though. This is the place, but... Mm. I'm sorry, Clive. The blight. There's no weapon spared. What do we do now? We keep looking. 
Man's Hill cannot be the only place where snow daisies grow. Perhaps, but it's the only place I know of. You of. Then why not ask someone who might know of another? Someone at the backyard. To the hideaway, then. Ah, this is the back and forth portion of the game, right? <laughs> Let's hope one of the gardeners knows where to find snow daisies. Ugh. Went the wrong way. Of course, you can go the other way, but it's just loop de doop. Loop de doop down there on the place. Don't want to do that. No, don't, don't. Say what you will, Lady Karen. <coughs> if I start getting gaggy, I might have to turn off the mic. Comes and goes. Oh, what brings you down from the heavens, Sid? I need your advice. Joshua and I are looking for a place where snow daisies grow. Preferably in abundance. Snow daisies. Then you'll want somewhere not too hot and not too cold. And where the winds are strong enough to carry the seeds. Uh, I reckon Man's Hill would be a good place to start. There in the Royal Meadows, perhaps? Both have similar climbs and the right elevation. If the Blight hasn't claimed them yet. Right. Thank you. All right. Wasn't I just there, though? I'm confused. Did you learn where we might find our flowers? The gardener here mentioned the Royal Meadows in Sambrak. Oh. Ah, the fields beyond Northreach. Well, if that's the case, then Yote was right. <gasps> I recall that she kept the record of our travels, you see. Uh, uh, so I asked her if she'd perhaps noted anywhere that snow daisies uh, grew. See? And she mentioned Oilerfeist Bay. He was already talking about it. shores border the meadows. <coughs> Off we go, then. The winds that blow across the Royal Meadows from Oilerfeist Bay are strong indeed. Strong enough for snow daisies, it seems. Oh god! I am falling more and more in love with Joshua right now. It's like, I can't deal with it. <laughs> can't deal with it right now. The garrison is threatening to pull their sentries from the market. The way things are going at the garrison. What? What's he doing? She's not there. What's he? I would speak with this ship. Saw the captain just now. Hang the chickens. What crap? <coughs> if Philippe is gone, who's our new captain? Welcome back. Great to see Burb in the way. Burb. Out of the way, Burb. The meadows are vast. Where do we even start? Yote mentioned the coastline. We can start there. Hora. Origin, eh?
Goodbye. Nani. What do you see, boy? These guys, I hate these guys. Let's hope this is the last one. Only one way to find out. Get in the way. <laughs> that was harder than I expected. Ah, show it. Jill will like them. <laughs> She'll love them. Come on. Let's go. Uh, you're gonna bring... Hold on. If Joshua's gonna tag along, that's gonna be awkward. <laughs> Joshua can't tag along. <clears throat> He'll, like, pretend that he has something to do. Uh, 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 uh. It appears my work is done. Yep. The rest, as they say, is up to you. There you go. Well, you and the skies. We wouldn't want another thunderstorm now, would we? <laughs> I love him. Oh, I love him. <laughs> Good boy, Joshua. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs> When did I get all? Ah, uh, yeah. have everything that looks kind of awkward though a weird altar of things trinkets oh 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 okay here we go Jill <coughs> there's something I'd like to show you there is and where might this something be it's uh, not here now I know this is sudden but how would you fancy a trip to Oriflam And he just walks away. 
You want to go to Oriflam? Bye. <laughs> <clears throat> There are so many. This is what you wanted to show me. Oh, yeah, I, I don't know what to say. You don't need to say anything. Oh my. The I don't know, enough. man. It, there's just something about these two about characters. You. I don't feel their Joshua connection. Do you remember when I took you to Man's Hill? Or... <laughs> Like, Try it seems to. forced in a way. From a story perspective, you know? It's like not character based. In the end, it only a nasty cough and a stern scolding from your mother. But I felt wonderful nonetheless. I'm sorry. I had no idea what I was getting us both into. But I couldn't bear to see you like that. Before we left, my chambermaid told me she'd overheard your mother talking about my marriage prospects oh, Lord. with some of the noblewomen at court. They were debating whether it would be more profitable to marry me off to one of the high houses instead of saving me for the ducal line. No one thought to ask me what I wanted. I was nothing to them. A pawn at best. I felt so trapped. So lonely. I didn't know. But I wasn't alone. You were there. Your hand in mine as we ran for those oaks. And I knew then, no matter what happened, I would be all right. I'll never forget that feeling. There's still nothing that directly connects them to any greater feeling for each other. You know what I mean? <clears throat> it still hasn't taken that step in my my eyes my feeling <laughs> oh boy before we broke camp the morning after the storm do you know what I did <laughs> oh, what I slipped away from my governess to climb the tour. And from there, I saw a sea of petals, all reaching for the sun. And I realized... that no matter how terrible the night, dawn would always come. That you, that you would always come for me. <laughs> and Be nice. Uh, come on. Again and again. <laughs> mm -hmm. Where do you see us? Where all this is oh. over? Oh, 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 oh. Oh. I don't know. That was a direct question. Not here, though. I think I've outgrown the twins. That's not what he was asking. After everything we've been through, the realm just seems so small. It's not a location. I need some space to spread my wings. Oh, uh, 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 so. <laughs> That's what you'll have. Oh my god. Ah, 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 ah! You'll stop at nothing to see that you do. Ah! Chotto, 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 chotto! <laughs> well, about fucking time! Are you kidding me? Ah! I never was much good at garlands. But it'll have to do. She's gonna put it on. I'll treasure it forever. Oh, I thought, I thought she was gonna put it on his head. I, I wanna see it on his head. For this, 
the flowers, <laughs> everything. It's exactly what I needed. Oh, come on, come on. Ah! You are my treasure. Oh, for God's sake. Come on. It's a perfect bed of roses. <laughs> Daisies. <laughs> to roll around in. <laughs> come on. It's too PG. <laughs> We should probably be getting back. I expect the others are wondering where we are. You're right. There's still much to do. It's like if you think it about it, together. we got more than that in like freaking Xeno Gears way back in the day. <laughs> right? Now that was some pixelated ass. <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> And the end. Ah, <laughs> uh, Nankana. Shining him. Oh no! Oh, but she's gonna just get in the way of Joshua. She's oh man. I don't. Mm. I probably should have done this later. <laughs> I more party is too crowded though. I wonder can you like select who you want? Oh, what the fuck's going on there? Oh, God damn it! Garrison is threatening to pull their sentries from the market. I would speak with this Jew. So the captain. Just now. Your town needs you. Oh man. Uh. Now what? Do you have a moment, Clive? What is it? It's the Duke, unsurprisingly. His eminence has assumed full control of the garrison. The town was left all but unguarded, so Philippe was compelled to form a citizen's watch, and though my dear boys have been characteristically willing to assist him in this, so I was wondering no, no, no. if you would lend them your strength, that the people of Northreach might sleep easy. Of course. Thank you, Clive. Philippe, where can I find... <coughs> Here, my lady. To whom do I have the pleasure of speaking? My name is Sabine, and it is my displeasure to be the daughter of the Duke of Oriflam, who I understand is causing you and your town no. I wish to oh speak boy. to you about. Very oh, well. Oh boy. I trust you'll forgive. Absolutely. Please. As you know, indeed, I owe you my for continue. Yet I fear. Hi, 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 hi. Can't deal with. Can't deal. Yes, yes, yes. Oh dear God. Oh my God. She certainly has spirit. Indeed. Uh, but unfortunately for us, that spirit is only likely to harden the Duke's, which may be enough to seal the th This is all about her and her families. I'm sorry. Well, ah, uh, yes. I was about, but perhaps it's better that you heard them from him. Right away. It's just a pity I cannot. Hi, hi. So now what? Where is he? <coughs> Outside of town. <clears throat> yeah, I took a COVID test and it was a negative, so who knows. It seems to have like all it seems I seem to have all the um, common symptoms. So you are content to abandon Oh boy. Please, I beseech you. If you are a true son of Northreach, you must fight to defend your home. That's exactly what I am. Or trying to, at least. Even when our true enemy is hiding in the gap. Fine. Thank you so. <laughs> oh boy. She cornered you too, then. Could hardly get a word in edgeways. 
Like father, like daughter, eh? She made an uninvited appearance at the Vale earlier, hoping to convince the dame to join her in for men. <laughs> I bet that went well. Her ladyship seems to have a way with people. Anyway, what brings you here? Our mutual friend thought you might welcome some help. Oh, she did, did she? <laughs> right, as always. In fact, you're just a man. <clears throat> We've had some reports, you see. Sightings of... I didn't get up until two... You know what? This afternoon. They're back. <clears throat> Seems that way. All over, too. So I expect to we be awake We haven't been able to confirm anything life. yet, but if you're willing, Enjoy. you could go and see what's what. Right. Let's see what's what. You know Grieger's Weep? One of the sightings places them somewhere on its shores. I'm on my way. Thank uh, you, Clive. I'll look into... Hi, hi. Hi, hi, hi. Dogo? Achika. Ikimas. Ikimas. The burb? Burb. Burb. Go your burb. Fly, Ambrosia. My burb. Damn it. The reports were true. I need to stop them before they get to the town. Jill with me right now? Hold on. Joshua's there, but is Jill also with me? I didn't see her. Call that a test, Ultima. Clive, it's me. Are you alright? I am. But it seems the reports were true. The thralls have returned. I dispatched the few that I found, though. Well, that's something, I suppose. But what were they doing south of town? They all came from the north last time. We might be able to fend off an attack from one side or the other, but from both? Do you have eyes in the north? But from both? Son, I should probably go and have a look, though, just to be sure. Now, you head back to Northridge. I want you there just in case war breaks out while I'm away. What do you mean? Her ladyship's been busy working her magic on the townspeople. Stirring up ill feeling towards her father. But she'll have her marching on the barracks if we're not careful. What? This is exactly what the dame was afraid of. I'll do what I can to calm things down. Be careful out there, all right? Don't worry, I'm not like you. <laughs> <laughs> that would be funny if the conversation just ended on that, that one line. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm not like you. <laughs> what the hell? <clears throat> Do you not see, Father? Blue versus purple? The people purple? of Northreach have given enough, and only a fool would ask for more. Listen to me, Sabine. Where would our people be without <laughs> their country, hmm? The Empire is their sword and their shield. It is she that ensures they can live without fear. What's going on? How she teeters on the brink. She's... she's missing. How will the people fight? Without their shield, how will they protect their kin? Can the unarmed stand against the advancing hordes? No. 
know. But there is yet hope. A new shield, a new sword. A new empire. We can rebuild Sandbreck, just as great Grieger wills it. Perhaps we could, father. But we don't want to. Oh. Not if it is built on the broken backs of the people. Please, let us not quarrel in the street. You must see that no good will come of this. Our fight is not with each other, but with the threat that draws ever closer to our gates. A threat that your sword has yet to rid us of, your eminence. You will hold your tongue, whore. Oh. You may have filled my daughter's head with your heresy, but I will not be corrupted. Corrupted? Your daughter's opinions are her own, as you would know if you had ever deigned to listen to her. Oh, oh. At least I hope they are your opinions, and not posturing born of a family feud. Northreach deserves better than that. Northreach deserves better than you, Carla. Oh. Yes, I know who you are. Ooh. The slut of Twinside who bedded a brandit. <laughs> Jealous, are you? <laughs> that a woman might choose a bearer over a pious man of Grieger. Clive! <laughs> I met a swarm of thralls coming south from Oriflam. Hundreds of them. Too many to count. Oh, oh fuck you. Oh, you know, fuck. <laughs> work on the fortifications has scarcely begun. We will retreat to Cair Norvant and there make our stand. What? Did you hear me? That was an order. Can I retreat this place? While and let this it be is destroyed. A yeah. Plea. I don't Let's just so. make us stand here mm -hmm. and protect our homes. Mm -hmm. Protect those that we love. Mm -hmm. Together for Northreach. You heard the dame. What are we waiting for? Pikemen to the gates. Archers to the roofs, quickly, come on! <coughs> but she is but a common... Whore? whore. Yes. <laughs> and we'd follow her to the gates of hell. Men had their orders, and they looked like following them. I got them spaced out at regular intervals. Whichever direction the thralls strike from, there'll be someone there to meet them. Thank you, Philippe. Rest assured, the people will play their part. The herbalist has donated her stock of medicines to me. Should any of your men be injured, take them to the Vale. We'll see to them there. Thank you, milady. I will. I'll play my part too. You still want for numbers? Unlike the enemy, I only hope I can go some way to evening the odds. Philippe, can I leave the south in your hands? I doubt the thralls by the lake were the last of their number. Of course. I'll lead a party down that way so we don't get taken by surprise. What about you? I'll make my way up the road to Oriflam. I fought a few of these things. And while I can't promise to hold them all back, I should be able to thin the herd. All right, but take care. Thank you, both of you. <coughs> you can thank us when it's over. <coughs> Till then, madame. Uh. Hi, 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 hi. So what? What are we doing? Sorti? No, no. Eh, donne. Just a minute. Eh, I keep hitting the wrong one. Let's see if we got all the good stuff. Yes. 
Items we have. Choi match. Items. Yes, we're fine. Ah, we should probably save them. Hold on. Okay. Ah! More suck. <sighs> <coughs> Oh yeah, Jill is with me. Welcome to the party. Or not. Oops. Can't jump over there. <laughs> Can't jump the wall. Steal in the hands of every How do we get out? I went out. Were we ever told what is like the cause of the ether floods and stuff? There are so many of them. Not for long. Not for long. Let's gather them all over here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. More. Is it over? No. No. Of it's only not. just begun. Yeah. Of course. Oh shit! <laughs> he's he's charging me. And that hit nothing. Piece of shit. And then he hit me as well. I don't think so. Crap. Whoa! <laughs> I hate these big guys. These big guys annoy me. No, no. Oh. Up the butt, up the butt, up the butt. Nice try, up the butt. Yes, 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 yes. That wasn't too bad. Hmm. Hmm. That looks to be the last of them. I wonder how the others fared. Better hurry back to town. Come on, Toggle. Come on, Popper. Let's go home. Hello, welcome. Yes. You, 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 you! Clive, it's good to see you. And you. The road to Oriflam is clear. How did you and your men fare? Well, we ended up fighting for our lives down by the lake. Took a few nicks. But nothing the girls of the Vale can't put right. <coughs> Glad to hear it. Well, it seems we've survived. For the time being, at least. I thank you both for answering the call. You were right. And I was wrong. Obviously. About everything. I had thought that the only way to unite the people was under the banner of Empire. That without a strong hand to guide them, they would drift apart. To be borne hither and yon by the eddying currents of fate. But you brought them together. Not by force. 
nor by the exercise of goddess-given authority, <coughs> but by simply being one of them. By knowing what they feel, because you feel it yourself. Our purpose was ever the same, your eminence. You were merely distracted by a loftier vision of empire and glory, while our eyes beheld matters closer to home. You have the right of it again, as did you, Sabine. His radiance said it himself. Sandbreck is naught without her citizens. I forgot that, and I am sorry. I'm sorry too, father. I should never have taken things so far. I only wanted you to understand how the people felt. How I felt. But my anger got the better of me. Do not blame yourself, my dear. This was my doing. I should have listened to you. To all of you. Your Duh. eminence. Your ladyship. I do not doubt that you came here with the best of intentions. But I believe the same could be said of us all. We all want safety, security, prosperity. Not just for Northreach, but for the entire realm. And we may yet achieve it. If only we work together. Will you join us in this? Yes. <coughs> we shall. Thank you, Your Eminence. Now that that is settled, I must go and see to the wounded. The Vale's doors are always open to any soldier in need of relief. And today there are more than ever before. Madam Isabel is a rare soul indeed. In these dark times, I see that it is not men like me who should lead the realm. But women like her. You're right. If only I'd listened to her when I had the chance. Forgive me for saying so, my lady. But you still do. The dame said it herself. We can turn things around. We just have to work together. And that goes for you, too. You're one of us now. One of you? Well said, Captain. Let this be a new beginning. Not only for Sandbreck, but for If us. it were all so easy. Well, since there's nothing more to be done here, talking I about see if there's no rose the colored glasses. Holy shit. That would never happen. Are you kidding? <laughs> How naive do you think we are? There's no need to worry any longer. No need to worry any longer. <laughs> I saw several soldiers being carried to the veil. The woman that they were just calling a whore is the one that they're now praising all of a sudden. It's like, the really? I'll be happy to man that would never happen. That would help. <laughs> You've helped quite enough for one day, Clive. No, Thank dude, you. I haven't finished this yet. <laughs> We're still like, there's still more. <laughs> You've done for this town. It, is the very it just keeps going and going. Tell me, if Northreach had fallen, what would you have done? A woman of your means could find a home anywhere in the realm, but I sense you would rather have died here. There doesn't seem to be very much of any urgency. It's Whenever an there's story. like a main point, it's Being like once you finish it, time world, ah, right? time to rest. <laughs> and you get all this time to like do sub quests and stuff. Well. <laughs> so it's like, seriously, do we actually mm, have that? <laughs> I had a life that, in a I don't know, freedom yet. to do I was then. whatever Courtesan the heck we feel like <laughs> so when the world is that it was only they <laughs> crashing down among us. My time. <laughs> Alas, <clears throat> those halcyon days were not to last. Halcyon. For naive as I was. I fell in love with a bearer. It's an either. It was my master's guard. 
The gentlest man I have ever known. After they discovered us together, he was whipped bloody and forbidden from ever looking at me again. And so we fled. Not that we had anywhere to flee to. We wandered, aimless and starving, half dreading, half praying that the next day would be our last. Until we found ourselves here, in Northreach. <laughs> Yeah, he knows. Took us in. He knows what they fed is. us, clothed us, and healed our hurts. Those that could be healed, at least. My love was already too far gone. Well, that sucks. He passed away. He did. Not long after we arrived. Ah. <sighs> but at least we were able to share a few moments of peace before the end. It was the greatest gift I have ever received. But the generosity of this town and her people did not end there. The men and women of the Vale supported me through my grief. Shared in it, though I was still a stranger to them. They treated me like a sister. And then a whore. And so I swore Wonderful. that I would always do the same. That I would return the kindness that Northreach showed me. That <laughs> I would repay my debt to the Vale. Thank you, Isabel, for sharing this with me. <laughs> You're a lot like him, you know. Perhaps that is why I have such a soft spot for you. Never stop fighting, Clive. Um, I shan't either. I know these, that it will not these be easy double to keep one each together. But our efforts will be rewarded. Just look at us now. The people, the soldiers, even the Duke of Oriflam and his daughter. All united in defense of this town that we have come to call our home. And what of you? Can we count on your support too? Always. End of conversation. <laughs> oh man. The way these conversations just abruptly end, it's like, yep, all done now. See ya. <laughs> Joshua! Joshua! Jill is like a, the third wheel. <laughs> Go away, Jill. Go away with you. Let's 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 have Joshua here in the corner. Josh, 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 my boy. <laughs> Stop evading me. <laughs> Come here, hither too. <laughs> As he does, Michael Jackson moonwalker. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well this place is done then, huh? Oh, God, one less quest to do. God damn. <laughs> what? Tell him no. <coughs> Do I still sound as shit as much as I feel? Probably. <clears throat> oi, 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 oi. Ah, Lubor. Here to help me back. Lubor. Thanks, but I'll Lube. be traveling light. <laughs> I'm almost finished already, in fact. Mr. Lube. You're really going to go through with this then? I am. But before I go, there is one small issue I'd like your assistance with. Well, two, in fact. If it's within my power to help you, I will. What? What does he want? Oh no, this the child. Children. It's a child. I refuse to let them share in my disgrace. And if I leave them here, they surely will. Our friendship would see them ostracized forever. But I can't take them with me either. I can think of only one place where they are certain to be safe. Oh no. Provided for and loved. The hideaway. It's an e e e e e e e e of course. 
The children would be more than welcome. Thank you, Clive. I will not forget this. Lumor, are you still here? What is it, Ferda? You look pale. There's been a flood in the village. How can you tell under that hood? The League of Outlaws encampment was completely submerged in ether. Ah. What? Yeah, be. Every last one of the bastards has turned. Ah, la, and headed this way. Ah, la, 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 la. Bandits are one thing. Cross and the Kashyyyk bandits are quite another. The town guard won't stand a chance against them. We need to evacuate. There's no time to lose. Further, gather the men. The Akashic may strike at any moment. You must make ready to cover the townspeople's escape. Well, what are you waiting for? <laughs> yes, my lord. Clive, <laughs> change of plan. The children stay with me for now. I need you to find Conrad and Natalie. Tell them to prepare for a full and immediate evacuation. Understood. The whole town? I'll do what I can to convince everyone else. I saw that. Hey! That sword is awesome. I like that design. Oh, oh, oh. Shit, shit, shit. Fuck. Okay. I do like that sword. Hi. What's in it? You have to listen to me. They're coming. They're coming. You, you must me. evacuate. <gasps> Get the fuck out! <coughs> ah, it's you. <coughs> what do you want, Lord Underhill? <coughs> to pass on an important message. There's been an ether flood out in the Velcroy. The camp where the so-called League of Outlaws were gathering has been swallowed. They're no longer just bandits. They're Akashic now. And they could be here at any moment. You need to begin preparing for a full-scale evacuation right away. Mm. Oh, do we? And who was it who gave you this disturbing news, might I ask? Lubor, perhaps? The man spreading the same poison out in the square as we speak. You may believe his lies, my lord, but What's we going on in the way but why would he background there? Something like this? In the kitchen. <laughs> some twisted attempt at revenge, I saw perhaps. some hard movement back there. If he had not there. been unmasked, he may well have been elected our leader. A great honor for one of his kind. Oh, there is a person one there. He might well feel <laughs> that looked funny. Having been denied. <laughs> Lord Underhill, what? what? Forgive me, yeah. but it has become what? all too going evident on where back your there? sympathies lie. <laughs> Lubor cannot be trusted, and neither, therefore, can you. You may not trust me, but for the sake of your people, ask yourselves mm -hmm. if there is any chance that this is true. There isn't. You can be certain of that. Now be off with you. All right, well, fuck y'all then. You're making a mistake. Mm -hmm. It's no use. Mm -hmm. Words will not move. Yep. Oops. Oops. Where's the other one? Oh God. Then we must find another way to ensure Dalamel's survival. All, All right. right. Let's speak to Lord Ferda. I think we better. <sighs> What's Lubor raving about? <clears throat> oh, took a minute. What do you got for me? <laughs> Good day, my lord. Hi. You said that you had something new, but I see. Oh, that one. Breath of darkness. I don't use any of those items. You don't need to. There's like no purpose. At least I, <laughs> I've well. seen no purpose to use any of these other items. So I'm, Lord I'm like, I really are upgrading. It, what's wrong? <clears throat> you to warn Conrad and Natalie about the Akashic, but yeah, that's the listen. the best weapon right now, and I can't make Lubor it yet. Says can be trusted. The bloody fools. <clears throat> Which means the town guard can't be counted on for support. But I can't. Oh man, I really need snacks. If there's anything I can do to help I have you no defend snacks. Down, you only have to ask. Uh, I appreciate it. Sid, further. I've been looking for you everywhere. I need snacks. Victor. I need I someone to left. go on a snack I couldn't abandon a friend in need. Nobody. And Blue Boy is in need at this very moment. Come quickly. What? Come quickly. I have no good snacks. I want like salty snacks. Like nuts or something. 
<laughs> Give me some salty nuts. What? You have to believe me. The Akashic are coming. Uh -oh. They don't eat. Are they gonna? They don't sleep. They don't tire, and they don't care who they kill. They're unlike anything that's come before. There won't be no parley, no mercy granted. No parley. Parley? You may have saved the town once, but this <laughs> is different. Parley, Jane. Do they not know how to not pronounce that, that word? Forgive me, but please believe me. If you do not run, you will die. You will all fucking die! You'd like that, wouldn't you, Bearer? Yeah, with us out of the way, your kind will be free to claim Dalamil for yourselves. Oh! You should run! <gasps> run, Bearer! Yeah, yeah. yeah run! run. Oh, uh, 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 stone him. Yeah. 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 Just go, Bearer! Yeah. Yeah. Wait, someone's coming. Oh, children. Stop! You're hurting him! You hurt children! Now it's time to think about your actions. Oh, did I hurt that child? Oh! Seriously? <laughs> what did Lubor ever do to you? Hmm? He solves all your stupid problems and he keeps all of you safe. You know there's nothing he wouldn't do for this town. Who was it who made that cleaver you use every day, Conrad? Mm hmm. And what about your counting table, Natalie? Who fixed that? <laughs> Whose men make sure the streets are clean so all your boots don't get dirty? Who spends all day But he's a bearer! Things run smoothly around Stone him. him! And none of you ever say thank you! Ever! But did Lubor ever complain? Well? Does he ever stop smiling? He keeps this whole place going! And you act like it doesn't even exist! <laughs> but he's a bear! <laughs> that may be true, but still, doesn't deny the truth. Lubo, we have heard enough. No! Wait! We will not run. The town guard will not abandon the very place it is sworn to protect. And I will not give up for lost the stores that we labored so hard to fill. It's so Disney, you know? <laughs> so tell us, how do you propose it's we deal so with this Akashic of Disney. yours? <laughs> Square Enix is... We won't run, the but we will Japan fight. equivalent of Disney. All right then. <laughs> I'll wipe it off. Yeah, yeah. Fine. Mhm. Mm Just brush it aside. Around if you don't want brush to it off. <sighs> We've done our part here. Let's go, and the whole town gets wiped out. <laughs> Are we done then? Allow me to explain the situation. Oh, for God's sake. I'm getting bored. The ether flood occurred near the village of Charitina, <coughs> deep in the Velcroy. The place had been abandoned for years. Getting until bored. Until the League of Outlaws decided to make it their base of operations. Now they're all turned, and if the scouts' reports are correct, heading in this direction. Of course. They are mindless monsters, driven only by hate and rage. 
They are utterly unpredictable. With the bandits, we at least knew how and where they were likely to attack. When these creatures come, Delamil will have the bitterest fight it has ever faced on its hands. Bitterest? will muster at the north gate. The rest of us will take the south. Both forces will provide men to serve as scouts and messengers, ready to spread word of the size and nature of the Akashic Force as soon as it is spotted. And as soon as it has been, we will converge on its position and see that it is driven back from Dalamil at all costs. Conrad, can I count on the support of the town guard? <coughs> Always. I leave the selection and coordination of the messengers in your hands, Victor. And the command of our men in yours, Ferda. If you would both be so kind, consider it done. As you wish. Natalie, I would ask that you and your people have the townsfolk barricade themselves inside the bathhouse. And tell the merchant not to waste time securing anything beside the essentials. Preserving life is our one and only concern. As long as we survive, it doesn't matter what trinkets we might lose. Our riches can be regained. And if anyone doubts that, let it be known that the Briar's Kiss stands ready to cover <sighs> any losses. Very well. I shall tell them. Where do I fit into this plan? <laughs> Good question. Where else but the most perilous place of all. Eh. I would like you to travel to the home of our erstwhile League of Outlaws, Chiratina eh. itself. Yeah, the host is most likely still there. Yeah, the you will not be safe until it is eradicated. Yeah, the oh my, oh my, the Ikunda. How pleasant. How pleasant. I doubt it. <laughs> I have a feeling these weeds will be particularly Doubt stubborn. It. Luckily, so am I. <laughs> so you are. <laughs> all right, then. We all know what we have to do. <laughs> now it's simply a matter of doing it. Oh, my God. For Dalamil. Hi, 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 hi. Of course. Put me in the, the front of everything. Obviously. Looks like everyone's ready. I'd better not keep them waiting. Good. That will keep some of them. Any man sighting an Akashi is to raise the alarm in the So ti takke. Oi? Oi 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 oi. Ah, so ti kai. Cha. Ti. Ah. Ndi. <coughs> hmm. There it is. The flood. Well, there it is. What's waiting for us inside? There it is. There it is. There it is. <laughs> Who knows what that that's a quote from? That's a quote from something. Hmm? There it is. We can't leave a single one alive. <sighs> No burb. No. We did not need the burb. That's kind of fun though, just going across the around the corner and there's like some zombie ass freak. If anyone knows what that that quote is from, you are my new best friend. No, 
not that! Oh, bullshit. Bull fucking shit. Fight. Woo! Oh, no! I did it wrong. Ah. <laughs> there it is. There it is. There it is. There it is. There, there. The there. league is disbanded. There it is. I should get back to Dalamil and see how the others fared. Ah, <sighs> uh, what? Sometime later. Everybody's okay. Ah! <laughs> All the Akashic we were able to find have been dealt with. Seems that might be the last of them. The last of them here, perhaps. Lubo, Sid, Clive has returned. Clive. Call calling me what Sid. Is from Charitina. <coughs> it's done. <coughs> Root and branch. I knew you wouldn't let me down. Thank you, my lord. Friends, the Horde has been driven back. The Akashic have been defeated. And we need not fear the arrival of any more, thanks to Clive. Victory is ours. We bloody did it. We saved Dalamil. Lubor, allow me to apologize. After all you have done for this town, we should never have doubted you. But we did, and you for know that, that sounds really good truly right now. Sorry. I we only hope that you can store. forgive us. Oh, God. We need you, Lubor. Dalimil needs you. <clears throat> so, if you would still like to be considered for the position of mayor, you have our backing. I feel like corn soup. <laughs> you do remember? <laughs> it's a very that Japanese I'm a bearer, thing, don't you? but it's so good. We do. But that is not a stain on your character. It is a stain on ours. We thought only of what we perceived bearers to be, not what you truly are. The man who saved Dalimil twice over. I see. But I will only accept your proposal on two conditions. Name them. Firstly, that you will both do everything in your power to rally your people to my cause. If the Town Guard and the Merchants League do not accept my leadership, it will be doomed from the start. <laughs> Unity is the key to defending Dalamil, and I do not doubt that we shall need to call on our combined strength again. When that time comes, I will expect us all to pull together. Just as we did today. Of course. You have our word. And secondly. <laughs> More conditions. accept that if I am to lead you, the mistreatment of bearers must be. Clunky writing. I've kind of been loosely paying attention. Any other citizen. It's they like this filler crap. I are, really have no interest. I don't. I don't. I'm like, as we I'm on Twitter do, right now. <laughs> came so close I'm like to flipping through topics. Everything. I'm like looking for. Conditions. <laughs> and we have only Sound one return. <laughs> Is what I'm. That you I'm searching for right now. For the good of <laughs> Did you see you the have. the expos? I'm so happy. I'm so Condition excited accepted. with this expos. Get it, expo. <laughs> Well then, <laughs> it seems my mayorship is all but confirmed. Oh. Do I get some sort of special hat? It's not very exposing of an expose, but still, it's it's good enough. <laughs> it's more How sad than anything. How fate can be. <clears throat> so long because ago, I had resigned myself he's to leaving Dalmil in a yearning disgrace. boy. <laughs> and now... He's very bad when he's like stuck yeah. by himself. For everything. Because he has to fend off all of the, the sounds and voices in his head. 
<laughs> Lubo. About the children. <clears throat> Fear not, you are of he, course he, relieved of your responsibility. He crumbles under so pressure when he's a alone. Cash, I can see them brought up as outlaws. I'll make sure they're safe here. So I he needs you will. a little bit of a and not just the children. Uh, someone to support. <laughs> I'll do my best. <laughs> Can't have all your hard work going to waste. I really, I really like the new illustration though because it's very ambiguous. It they did a good job of staying ambiguous. <gasps> Ooh, this is good too. Like he's, it's a night starry scene, and he's in like the ocean, right? So there's the reflection of all the stars in the sky in in the water. And so he's got like water droplets all over him, right? But his whole face is kind of like wet. So there's like water droplets and stuff all over. So it's very ambiguous. Is he crying or is he not? <laughs> but you can you can look at his eyes because there's like um light in his eyes that reflect more moisture there. <laughs> So it's like, oh, he's totally crying. Come on, just stop it. Oh, I got a silver trophy. Why, right, thank you very much. And they, and they, I didn't read the whole thing. And they something. <sighs> if they don't resurrect Lucifer for the 10th anniversary, I'm gonna boycott. <laughs> I won't boycott sound on a phone. I'll boycott something. <laughs> probably not the game, but I'll probably boycott something. <laughs> because the 10th anniversary. I mean, come on. No, because the 5th anniversary was like the end of that storyline, right? That was like the main thing with Sound on a Phone. That was the 5th anniversary. So we've been waiting for five fucking years for this. Come on! <laughs> Psychanes, get with it! We don't want more freaking Betty Aru! Ooh, I'm so tired of Betty Aru. And like every single, like, um. Fess? Like whenever they have the, the little stage act, whatever, with the with the actors playing the characters and stuff, there's always that scene where Sounds on a Phone is fighting Betty Aru, and he's always fighting Betty Aru, and he always fucking loses, or it's a tie or something, and there was one time he, he actually authentically won against Betty Aru, and I'm like, oh my god, that was amazing. <laughs> this one? <laughs> this one? I don't know what you're posting. You're probably... Are you posting a link or something? It might not work. Sorry. But if you describe it, I will probably know what you're talking about. <laughs> but the thing is, Sandalphone is like... He is so much more powerful than Bediel is. And it's so irritating to always see him lose to Bediel. It's really, really irritating. <laughs> Sanodophone is like the most powerful character in the whole thing right now. You know, if you go by any lore, whatnot. He's got fucking Lucifer's power. And so, it's not... He, he doesn't only have six wings, but he also has Lucifer's power as well. And so, twelve. That's how he beat fucking Lucius whatever the fuck his name is. They they screwed the names up for the English version. So it's like, I... It, it's difficult for me because I, I tend to use both names. <laughs> so, like, the Japanese names for them are Luciferu is Lucifer. And then Lucifa, Fa-san, Fa. Lucifa is Lucilius or something like that. They they messed up the the names and I don't understand why, I don't I don't understand. Seifuku? No. Ah ah. 
that's his that's his <laughs> that's his bathing suit. <laughs> it's like an old school bathing suit. <laughs> yeah, it's the one that's like almost completely blue. It's very very blue toned. Mm. Yeah, that's his summer outfit. They first designed that back in 19 2019. Yeah. Yeah. So it's a it's a it's a very old school bathing suit. Like from what the twenties or thirties or something like that. It's really old, that style. Mm. But it's very fitting for Sandalphone, if you understand. <laughs> He's like, I'm not showing you my body, <laughs> and then he goes to the onsen, <laughs> which is why I was so excited. That I'm like, oh my god, there's Sandalphone. He's like complaining about taking off his uniform and he goes to the fucking onsen and he's okay with it? He didn't even complain once. What? <laughs> I wanted I wanted to hear him complain. Oh. <laughs> Lucy Fittersome uh, <laughs> would not approve of me just wearing a towel in, <laughs> in a bath with a bunch of other men. Uh, will he be jealous? Is this okay for me to do? He didn't even know that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm complaining. Oh god, I need a break. I'm so I'm getting excited. <laughs> oh man. It's been a while. I haven't been able to talk. Ah uh, Alright, give me just a really quick moment. <laughs> Let me cool down a minute. And I'll be right back. One one sec. Sorry. Oh, all right, I'm back. Oh my god. Yeah, serious. It's bad. It it, it gets bad. <laughs> Sandarofilm is like my number one right now, so. And he has been for a long time. Mm, he's my Oshi. <laughs> Oshi no kone. So, oh my god. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> oh, did you see that? Yeah, yeah. I retweeted that. It was so cute. <laughs> it's very clever how people do that, too. Ah, <laughs> uh, man. Oh. Maybe I should do another Grand Blue play. Like, let's play or something. It's like, there's nothing new. So it's just like going through the same routine over and over and over and over again, but... 
<sighs> the little crumbs here and there. Ah, oh, man, I wish I could have done a, a live stream for the onsen thing. I don't think I can replay that. Can we replay that again? Hold on. I don't think we can. Because that... Ugh, that thing is over. It's over. Oh, God! You know what? Okay, so about the new illustration. So I kind of... All right, so I thought that the way that he was holding his hands with the water dripping down looked really kind of awkward. I mean, okay, yeah, you can kind of understand it, but if you reverse the colors, <laughs> doesn't it look like blood dripping from his hands? <laughs> I'm like, okay, I, I'm somewhat demented, so <laughs> I tend to, to think of things, like, in a dark way. So I'm like, doesn't that somewhat resemble, like, stigmata or something like that with blood in his hands and stuff? So I, like, reverse the colors, and it's super creepy because there's, like, a... I don't know, like, a circular motion in the water around him that also has the red because it's it's all the blue is replaced with red so it, it's super creepy <laughs> i'll probably post that the color rendition that i was working on i think i have it where is it i don't know where i put it i might be able to post it it's super as creepy hold on i might be i haven't posted it yet Super ass creepy redshift, like Hold on. I don't even know what what to call it. It's it's not really redshift, but color what? When you replace colors. Uh eh? Red design? I don't know. How do you even spell that? ちょっと待って。ああ。ちょっと待って。Why? Uh, uh, mm. Icons. I'll know it when I see it. And then the date created. Oh, it's super creepy. It's super creepy. I'm looking at it again and it's like, oh god. Ooh, it's super creepy. Super creepy. What what do you call super creepy things? Yeah, a, pal a palette swap? I guess, it, but it's not a complete palette swap. No, it's more I I I I changed a lot more than just Oh, it's super creepy. Super creepy. Oh my god. I can't. I, I, 
am I demented? I am probably... There's something probably wrong with me. Alright, hold on. Hold on, I'm posting it. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I can kind of imagine a story where it's like, if Lucifer was to be resurrected, it would have to come at a steep price. So I'm like, well, what would that be? And how much would somebody be willing to pay to resurrect Lucifer? Would Sandalphone actually be willing to sacrifice himself to bring back Lucifer? I think he would. I think he'd do it in an instant. And that's kind of frightening, you know? He would be willing to, to throw everything away, everything that he's, he's gone through, everything that he's, you know, survived up into this moment that just the thought of Lucifer being able to come back, I think he would sacrifice absolutely everything. But there is a line, like, he wouldn't sacrifice other people. It would just be himself. Like, he wouldn't want to... Like, if that would also include, like, Gran and everybody else, all the, the main characters, he would absolutely not do that. But if it was just him, and that might be the ploy that the other side makes him do, kind of gives sets this seed, this false seed in his head that Lucifer will be able to be resurrected if you do this, but it's false. It's not true. So it's like, I, I can totally see like Betty Yadu or even, you know, uh, see, that's the thing though, because Betty Yadu and Lucifer right now, uh, I'm getting names confused. Lucilius are kind of trapped in that other world. So if we do have a continuation of the story, it's going to have to be related to what the fuck's his name. What the fuck's his name? The other angel who is, like, obsessed with Lucifer. Ah, Lucilius. He's always like, Fasan, and he can't speak well. What the fuck's his name? I can't think of his name right now. I can... It's Ishida Akira does the voice. <laughs> That's bad. I know the I know the voice actor, but not <laughs> but not the actual character. What the fuck's his name? Oh I'm gonna go insane. Ishida uh Ishida Akira. What the fuck's his name? It's not uh, as 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 I always get the name wrong. As 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 what the fuck's his name? Sariel! Moksa! <laughs> Sariel! Sariel! Because Sariel is always like trying to. Oh, seriously? Oh my god! Okay, okay. Oh, it, this story is so good. <laughs> it's, um. I played through the whole thing, so I do have videos of it if you can sit through the thing. It's quite long. But it's so goddamn good. It's the um, triple zero storyline. Uh, chigao, chigao. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Chigao. Are chigao? What makes the sky blue? Eto, doshite sore wa aoi no ka? Doshite sora wa aoi no ka? And the reason why this this title is so meaningful is because it's actually it's not it okay so yes it's a question but it's not it's more of a prayer like in its usage why is this guy it's not you're not actually asking that it's it's deeper the meaning is so much more yeah meaningful the meaning is meaningful. <laughs> yeah. The coffee shop? Lucifer. Uh, ma. Uh, there's a little bit. I mean, he had his little... It was a lab. It wasn't a coffee shop. It was a lab where he was doing, like, experiments and stuff. And that's where, he, like, Sendlerphone 
that's where they first had like coffee together and that's where like sound out of phone began to like coffee initially he really disliked it but it's like oh, if i can all right fine so he <laughs> he just really enjoyed that moment that that time that they shared together in the lab and that that was a kind of in between place too it was like uh no i i'm i'm starting to forget things it, the story is very complicated <laughs> oh god that was an in between moment that was in a realm that does not exist Mm, that was at the end of the story. So if you saw that, you saw the end. But, Ma, I mean, when I first played it, I, I, I played... Hold on. Is that what I played first? I'm starting to forget. No, I think... Uh, oh, man, I'm, I'm forgetting now. I think... Oh my, oh my god. Okay, okay. Yeah. I didn't play it until the third chapter was out. So that was the, the double zero, the triple zero. That was the end. So I played that and I was like, I was dead by the end of that. And I'm like, that I didn't even know the, the backstory. You know? The first chapter is kind of dull. It's a slow burn, but the ending is really good. And then what really hits you is chapter, the beginning, ma, the beginning of chapter two. It, it just, oh, that killed me. I was so dead in <laughs> chapter two. Wait a minute. <clears throat> I streamed all of this because I wanted to have a, a recording of it. Cause I'm I'm lame that way. Hold on, where is it? I know I'm not playing the game right now. I'm kind of talking, but do you mind? Maybe I should put it on pause. Ugh. Maybe I'll go here. <coughs> <coughs> Hold on. I'm getting excited. Huh? It's still, it's still active. It's still active, I just downed it. I downed it! <laughs> mm, I just, I just... Freaked me out for a minute. Alright, hold on. <coughs> um. <sighs> I do not like how YouTube categorizes playlists. Sort by... Just show them all. Show them all. Why does it not show them? Oh my god. It's irritating. And then you can't find what you want. This is Ah, this Ah. one word that's a one word thing it always puts the the red squiggly underneath it 
drives me insane. <clears throat> Now what am I doing? I lost track. I'm done here. Yosh. Ja. I'm the map. I'm the map. I'm the map. Do, 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 do. We're slowly finishing all the extra. Yeah, Lucio. Lucio. <laughs> There's one clip that's still on my my Twitch channel <laughs> from one of the. It's a, a hel it's from a, a very amusing moment. <laughs> Dear God. <coughs> Where was that? <coughs> Doris. Sid, do you have a moment? What do you want, By Doris? Means. It's my old. Yeah, the shark. Shark! There's no escaping <laughs> I love how the sharks send me a letter. They growl. Shark! <laughs> Records from a Waluda prison. Seems it's to be very a lot of bearers there. How did she come by such a thing? Finding bearers always was her story. Grand Blue has an amazing, it seems the cells like, of versatile them. story. Foreign captives, where they can do the, the serious shit really, really no well, but also the funny. And even better for her. Comedic stuff. No one to look so. After them. Immaculately when done. Lapping at the walls, the jailers fled, leaving the bearers to be liberated by whoever happened to come along next. Sid, I'd like to believe that I've earned your trust by now. And while I'm well aware that you've forbidden curse breakers from traveling to Walud, I can't let those bearers die in their cells. Tashka. I'd rather risk shipwreck on the shadow coast than leave them to starve. Tashkani, Tashkani, well, let's go together. We'll be needing the Enterprise if we're going to navigate the Narrow. Does that mean... I'm making an exception. That we travel together. And we stay no longer than we have to. Ash is an inhospitable place at the best of times. We save as many as we can, and we leave. Mm. Thank you, Sid. There was a name <coughs> in the prison register. A name from my past. Oh? Chadwick. Another of my former master's protégés. A gifted soldier, and the closest thing I had to family. The oh. thought of him held captive in that place. Mm. He must be very important to you. He was. Is. Then we find him. The entrance to the prison lies in the shadow of Ravenwit Walls, just beyond the portcullis. We should head there as quickly as we can. I only pray there are still bearers alive to save. As do I, Doris. Hi. Sorry, day. What's in Kunukai? Kimasu, are you? Ah, Sochi? Chotamate, Chotamate. Sochi Nanuka. Wa, 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 Sochi Kitakune. Kitakune. There's going to be a, a huge boss there, Janai. <coughs> As I gagged it. Mm. 
怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い怖い行きたくねえ怖い怖いあれこっちで合ってますこっちで合ってますこっちあっあっバルマンクバルマンクドットハクジャンウェーウェーウェーウェーウェーだな<笑>誰ドーズ。Or what's his name? No gods, I take it. None manning the gates. No, it's a different story inside, though. The corridors are crawling with a k a s h i k Most likely guards left behind when the wardens ran. If Chadwick was being held here, I worry that he may already be. Don't give up hope just yet, but let's move quickly. She、I、reminds me of what's her name from the Game of Thrones. There. Then I'll search the upper level. <coughs> Good luck, Sid. Like the Stay safe. Really strong female soldier. What was her name? That's kind of who she reminds me of. Just how bad are the floods inside the walls? Bad enough to turn a bearer. I hope not. We're、yeah. risking a lot just being here. So then, ah. Better keep my eyes open for signs of life. It's nice having Joshua and Jill with me, though. I must say. I would much rather have them with me than be alone! Not alone! Find and rescue the captive bearers. Who is doing that? Now, hold on. Before we, we come up here, though, hold on. We should probably look all around downstairs. So let's remember this is 
<sighs> the staircase. Hi. So let's look around here to see if there's anything that we can possibly save. Was a Kuza. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Feeding bearers to it. This is even worse than I'd feared. Oh, that's sick. Minimal loss of Waluda lives. And what happens when they run out of bearers? So then, huh? The Imperials take better care of their branded than that. Mm -hmm. Hi, so this side is done. <coughs> <coughs> Let's go back. Those are the stairs, correct? Okay. Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. No, no. Oh, that's upstairs, dude. Yeah. There. Oh, Chigawa. Chigawa. Oh, man. I find it more and more difficult to, like, read. <laughs> It's like, I, I'm so impatient. It's really bad. <clears throat> so this place was no ordinary prison. And I doubt they'll have taken the creature with them when they fled. Mm-hmm. It's probably still here. The Kuza. Kuza! Down here. Not to be confused with Yakuza! I should go and see how Doris is getting on. That's a different Kuza. <laughs> a different... A different Kuza altogether. <coughs> Whoa! Excellent! Yeah! Party on, dude! Ha <laughs> ha! Dear God. Oh, we are, dude. It's dust in the wind. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I was very pleased with the the new Bill and Ted movie. Oh man. I'm such a dork. No luck downstairs. But I did find out that this place was more than just a prison. Something far more sinister was happening here. I know. I've been reading some of these documents and... It can't be true, can it? 
Bearers die every day in service of their masters, but this... This is so much worse. Pitting bearers against a wild beast armed with nothing but their wits? And all in order to bring about more death. And not just those who could fight, but the elderly, children even, and those who wouldn't or couldn't were disposed of, whatever that means. I'm afraid it means they were fed to the monstrosity they kept here. Then we're too late. Oh, no. And I was a fool to bring you here. Don't say that. Did you find anything else? A key. But it doesn't fit any of the locks on this floor. Perhaps it will fit one of the doors downstairs. There's a corridor I haven't searched yet. Finish up here, then come and find me when you're ready. All right. <coughs> I'll be there in a moment. <sighs> She's still looking for somebody. Come on, just give us some good news somewhere, please. That would be nice. Punch the dude? Died. Oh shit. What the fuck is this? Oh, there's something down there. Oh no. Mm? Kick. Can we. Yeah, we can. Yeah. Watch me get stuck down here now. Oh, okay. Inaccessible. Well, it's accessible now because I got the key. Piece of shit. Delet. Access Let's see what we can find down here. <laughs> As opposed to access denied. Access denied. Access. Oh fuck! I'm not going that way. Nope. 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 No, 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 no. Amber, that'll make a beautiful necklace. Thank you. No, 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 no. A kid? Survivor. And she sounds close. <coughs> well, not close enough. Doko. Coco? What the fuck you doing here, kid? A bear? A bear kid! There's no need to be afraid. Are you alone? Are there any other survivors? Some of the guards, they're still here. But something's wrong with them. Everyone else was eaten by the monster. <sighs> of course they were. Thank the founder. <sighs> it was worth our coming. I'd rather we didn't linger. Are you ready? Ready when you are. Hmm. At least I you found the kid. Thing. He must have been terrified. Did, did Theatrix send you? What? Well, he fought the monster. Distracted it so I could run away. He must have sent you. He promised to free the others too. Where is he? He opened your cell, didn't he? Wouldn't be here otherwise. Chadwick. Uh, monster time. Was that the monster? The monster's back. Chadwick, help! We have to get out of here. Doris, keep the girl safe. Yeah, we're gonna. All right. You put that bear-eating bastard in the ground. So 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 so. So <laughs> I was just gonna say that we're gonna put that beast in the ground. <laughs> in the ground. You're safe now. We won't let it hurt you. It's out there waiting for me. Oh, for fuck's sake! It's a chimera. If it's got a taste for bearers. 
or something similar. That looks like a fucking chimera to me. Or a behemoth? Oh, it's a oh, it's a behemoth. It looks like a a weird fucked up behemoth. Not hold on. Give me item. Item. Bloody hell. I don't want a fucking bloody hell. What am I gonna do with that in a fight with a behemoth? Seriously, come on, think, guys. Come on, come on, come on. Alright. So down here is finished. I haven't searched upstairs yet. Correct? Is that correct? Do I remember accurately? I don't think I was completely finished. Exploring upstairs yet. Let's go back upstairs. Let's go upstairs. Yeah. What was that ding for? Oh, look at it. Oh, oh, look at it. Oh, yay. Oh, yay, 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 yay. What are the things on its back? Really? Do you? Do you really need those? Come on. <coughs> Where the fuck's Chadwick? Or at least his, his bones. Namone. Have I already been? Have I been here already? What about the other side? Eh? I haven't been to the other side, have I? People, you must help me. I don't remember. My memory is very short. And I can't... I can't remember. Oh, you can't get that way! What? No, hold on. Nande? <laughs> no, don't, don't do that. Jump. Just jump like a normal human. Thank you. So there must be stairs over here too, right? Can we not go up? Come on, let us go up. No, obviously we cannot. Nope. There are no st other stairs that go up this way. Raksa! Ah, Kokukai! Piece of shit, open the fucking door. I wanna go over there. Those are... So, 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 before we go in, let us, let us save. Chop the mud in This is going to be the way in. We shall save. No key. Yeah, for the stairs up. Uh, mm -hmm. I don't think so. You think I missed a key somewhere? If you have more knowledge than me, please let me know. <coughs> Is that other wing accessible? It's not on the map. So I kind of doubt that it is. Because, like, even even if it's not necessarily accessible to you, it should be on the map. Okay, yeah, yeah. Sorry, sorry. I don't, I don't think it's accessible. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Let's go! Arekinainda! How? Eh? How? Quest destination nearby, Nandakid. Do. Oi, 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 oi. How am I supposed to get in there with the beast? Kotchikai. What's in a Kashik? Behemoth, Jenna. Uh, it's a rank A. Ma 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 ma. Peek 
けるだろう。いけるんだよ Hands are getting tired. <coughs> All the end. Not too bad. Not too bad. Kawaiisu na na yo na kara kashik dasu, das, das, dasu. Finally. Sid, are you hurt? Bitsuni? I'm fine. I think. <laughs> Is that a yes or a no? Ah! Oh, I found him! No! I found what's left of him! Oh, no. Eaten by the beast! That? A diary. I gave it to Chadwick before we went our separate ways. Ah, my lover. Here. Do you think that creature? I'm sure he fought bravely to the last. The girl is safe thanks to him. Chadwick, you fool. Come on. We have to get her back to the hideaway. We don't want his sacrifice to have been in vain. No. Of course not. I'll see that she's looked after from now on. It's the least I can do. I hear you've barely left the girl's side in days. I hope she's recovering from her ordeal. She is. Slowly, but surely. She's far tougher than she looks. I thank the flames we found her. If we hadn't... I know. But we did. I'm sorry we weren't able to save Chadwick. There's no need to apologize. Without your help, I would never have found out what happened to him. How he fought to the bitter end to save her. To save Hyda Marie. 
That's the man I remember. The man I thought of as a brother. I wish I could have met him. I'd like to hear more about your past. If you don't mind, that is. Of course. Oh my god, I just had a really master. good story idea. She trained Chadwick and to do two things. Kill and obey. We were supposed oh to be sold god. to the highest bidder when the time came. But no bid was ever high enough to convince her to part with us. What if it's actually we Sandarathon that opens the gates? But we could never quite shake our doubts <laughs> about the In a moment of do. weakness. What if it's then, like... One day, his his own power is the anymore. supreme primer. So we escaped. If he the uses his blood to question, open the gates, found us too easily. I wonder. After so many years of training, <laughs> the pull to serve was always just strong. imagine. It scared me to think he might have taken another master, become a dagger in someone else's hand. But even in captivity, the battles he fought were his own, and he died not as someone's tool. I kind of don't like it though. I kind of want it to be. There is can cast oh, the fuck off the shadows. I kind of want Sarieru to do it. Breakers will show them how to open I'll the gates again to allow to see it <coughs> Lucilius and Beriaru back. And for all of us, because they're they're confined. Like we'll be counting on you. In whatever whatever nether regions <laughs> that they're in. Yes, I'm still on this grim loot. Thing because I'm I'm getting bored with sub quests, so it is what it is. <coughs> so it mm, don't know. Or I wonder. Okay, so if if there was any like meaning in the power of his own like physical blood and whatnot, if that could like stop whatever Sarieru tried to like like if Sarieru tried to to open the gates or whatever, and the only way to stop that would be to like relinquish whatever power that Sandarafon has. And that would include like like a blood sacrifice or something like that. I could totally see that happening. <laughs> like his last ditch effort to like stop and protect everybody, you know. But if that was all a fabrication just to get him to do that, oh. <laughs> That would also prompt Lucio, Lucio, to do something, I think. He's been so, like, on the outside, outskirts of everything, so... And he's, he's the closest to the, to the gods of the, the whole thing, right? He's one level down from the main two gods. The main two. There are two, but there's originally one. So it was one god split into two. <coughs> so that's very. It goes back to the very lore of Grand Blue Fantasy. <coughs> and I'm probably not remembering everything very accurately, but that's the whole difference between the sky god and the this, the astral god, the stars. It's sky and star. <coughs> Anything new here? I think there might be something new. What? What do you have for me, Moguri? Moguri! Hotondo Zambu ya chatta yo! Ato, mo, 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 chotto, kono S. S no yatsu ga. Hm. Hm. Oh god. Shall we go do this guy? <laughs> Let's do him. Let's go down there and do his ass. Let's do his ass into the <laughs> into the ground. Let's do <laughs> That sounds so bad. Let's do his ass into the ground. 
<laughs> on the ground. <laughs> Hi, let me take a really quick break and I'll be right back. One moment, please. Don't you gonna? Quite so, My initial. Did we just save? I think we just saved, didn't we? I think we just did, but just in case. Because I'm afraid. I'm afraid! Hi. Ah! We don't need to talk to him. We already know where it is. Stop it. Don't pause. What the fuck? No. We know where he is. Ah, uh, from the world map, I don't know. Eh? Ah! From the world map, I don't know. He's... Come on! What's his name? Rosaria Janina. こっちはこっちもねえなこっちねえ違う違うこっちこっちこっちじゃねえおっこっちあこっちだはいこっち。let's go down there and get that asshole Burb. Burb. Koi. Burb. Ready go, go Zay. Fly, Ambrosia. Go, Zay. My Burb. Koi na, nanka. Koi yo. Jamma Jamma da ka Mou chotto ka na? Kono saki ka na? So 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 Yada na Yada 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 Ikitaku ne Ikitaku ne How Oh that's Cause I'm on the burb Oh, there he is. Kue de kakuna. Look at that piece of shit. Are you kidding me? All right. Let's save here. <coughs> this might be a, a fruitless battle. 
It might not work. I guess we'll try. Holy fuck, that dude is huge! Do 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 Let's get around his ass! Let's get around his ass! Oh, he's level 50! Oh, this might not be a good idea. I didn't mean that already. It's not even doing anything. It, it's... <clears throat> what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Is that slow-mo? What the fuck's going on? I'm so confused right now. Is the game slow-mo?
難しかったけどそんなにそんなにうう、うう、fallen enigma ふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふんふはい。I would like something. That would be very nice. I'm running out of things to do. That makes me very sad. I mean, it's one thing to be like bombarded with so many different things all at once, but it's like now that it's coming to a close, it's like, oh, I know what's next. No. So that dragon is a level 50. I'm not quite level 50 yet. <coughs> There's something about it. Something about it. it. I was wondering if you could help me. What do you want? It depends what with. <laughs> exactly. A bearer, but recently freed from his bonds, is keen to join the curse breakers. Oh, okay. As you know, the work we do is not easy, which is why we test every volunteer's suitability. I was hoping you could oversee this one's evaluation. I don't mind, but why this one? Because he wants to be a scout.、Oh. Our ranks are filled with men and women capable of breaking chains and putting slavers to the sword. But scouting, we're few with the nose for that, which is why we still rely so heavily on Gav. And since he accompanies you on so many of your missions, I thought you might be better placed to recognize the traits in him that we should look for in those who'd fill his boots. Sounds reasonable. So, you're happy to oversee the boys' test then? My time is yours. One can never have too many scouts. Truer words. <coughs> I'll let the initiate know that you'll be attending his trial and that he is to proceed directly to Northreach in readiness. No time like the present, eh? No time like the present. I'll await you there. Northreach. I don't suppose they could have chosen somewhere closer. Dun da dun 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 Bum 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 ba bum bum dun dun <sighs> Still no level gain, eh? So 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 tale. I don't know what I'm doing yet. Stop it. Where am I going? Hmm? Kochi? North Reach, eh? Oh, yeah, yeah. What? What do you want? What do you want? Outside the obelisk. Oh, God. <clears throat> nanny, nanny. What? Nazem might at least have mentioned where in North Reach he'd be testing this recruit. Well met, Sid. Oh, I'm、okay, kidding. This is the initiate.、Uh, Ember, present yourself. 
At your service, master. Embers. Please, just sit. There are no masters here. Your life is your own. Oh, of course. Thank you, Sid. <laughs> the sergeant says you'll be evaluating me at my trial. To become a scout, yes. You are aware of the dangers inherent in that role. I am. But I swore I'd face them. Just like the man who saved my life. And who would that be? Gav. It was him who found me and freed me. Mm. No magic, no support, just one man and his nose. Mm. Came and sniffed me out. It taught me what one man can do if he puts his mind to it. And I've been training Level. ever since, so that one day I can be someone's savior, just like Gav was mine. <laughs> I'm sure he'd be flattered. You clearly have good intentions, Ember. And it sounds like you're under no illusions. Stick to this path and you'll make a fine curse breaker. So, what? Have I passed? <sighs> you haven't even started yet. Now listen. Not far from here is an Imperial lookout, East Watch. The guards there record all their sightings in a logbook. You are to find it and bring it here. And bring it here, right. Anything else? No. Sneaking into a heavily guarded Imperial outpost and stealing the logbook would be quite sufficient. You will need to assess the situation, determine a point of entry, create a distraction and effect an escape, all without being discovered and thrown into an Imperial oubliette. Ember, Gav isn't our best scout because he can do everything. It's essential that you know your limits. Know my limits, right. I won't let you down. It shouldn't be as dangerous as I made out. But keep a weather eye on him all the same, would you? On my way. All right, Ember. <coughs> Impress me. Hi. <sighs> so much guy. Hidori. It's like he's cat calling the poor bird every single time. Yeah, beautiful bird. Beautiful bird. Can't do it. Caution, brother. Uh, Joshua! Joshua! Must protect! Must protect! Hey, Perhaps young Ember really is ready. Hi. Up, 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 up. Ah! Or maybe not. Or maybe not. You deserve a rest. <laughs> Or maybe not. Oh my god. <laughs> Wolf whistling a bird. So. So nan desu. I can't do it now. It's too funny. See? It's cat calling. Cat calling the burb. Damn it. Ember. Draw your sword! Uh, uh, oh! oh God. I forgot! What do you mean you can't? Run. Uh, um. <clears throat> if you want him, you'll have to go through me. I've just had enough of all these guys. I just... I'm gonna lay down the... The main then and he's still half what the fuck is this guy but he's only level 40 oh fuck off man give me thunder give me thunder forgive me wrath <laughs> 
I don't know. Get off me. He ran away. Gone. <laughs> of, course. of course. Scouts really are a rare breed. Uh. <laughs> Back to Northreach it is then. Dude. I didn't expect you back so soon. Where is Ember? How did he fare? I thought I'd find him with you. He must have fled. I followed him to Eastwatch, where I found him being set upon by a wild Avis. He was just standing there. Didn't even draw his sword. I had to step in and take care of things. But by the time I had, he was nowhere to be seen. I assumed he'd set off in your direction, but... Apparently not. Apparently not. Oh, I'm sorry, Sid. <sighs> I knew the boy had a nervous streak, but he seemed like... The right man for the job? Ha. Huh. I believe this is the logbook you tasked me with retrieving. Hey? Huh? How did you... Don't you tell me you breached the tower while Sid was busy saving your skin. What? Wasn't that what you asked me to do? <laughs> to bring the thing back without getting caught? Piece yeah, of shit. Learn, is there? And he did it all on his own. Mm -hmm. Sid, he... He did what he thought was best. And now I have to decide whether I agree. Mm -hmm. Of course. We'll await your evaluation back at the hideaway. Don't you leave my sight. Yes, Sergeant. <laughs> You piece of shit. He's sneaky. This won't be an easy decision. Soldana? Soldana. Soldana. So you know, Yakuari ga aren't da kara sa. Kimeru no. Oh, you should have seen him. The thing didn't stand a chance. Yeah, neither did you, I hear. <laughs> Welcome back, Sid. Welcome back, Sid. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome back. Trip wasn't too much of a pain in the ass, I hope. Uh, Truth be told, it was me who suggested roping you in to help with the trial. But from what I hear, Things didn't go quite as planned. No, they most certainly did not. Passive wax? Doshio kana? No, but to me, he did it. He was he was cunning. He I mean, got what he. Amber lost his nerve in the face of a beast of prey, but he didn't lose heart. He pressed on. And he achieved his aim. So the show. And is that not what we ask of our scouts? So Indeed it is. Thank you for your honest appraisal, Sid. The fact remains, however, that Ember will not always have a battle-hardened warrior on hand to pluck him from the jaws of peril. 
False. All I have gleaned from this trial is that without someone watching his back, Ember oh. is little more than a liability. False. Wait, Sergeant. Ember still has much to learn, it's true. And this time he was found wanting. Wanting? Least you a second chance, nonetheless. I'm After wanting. all, he did do as you asked. <laughs> With a bit of hard work, any hand can be made to hold a blade. And any mind can conquer its fears. Sounds but a scout's great. nose is different. You've either got one, or you ain't. And by sniffing out that log, young Ember here has shown he has a conch and a half. Wouldn't do to waste him now, would it? Fine. One more chance. I'll do whatever you ask. I'll spend my days and nights in the pit if I have to. I'll show you. Just you wait. Daft as a brush, that one. But his heart's in the right place. Just like someone else we know. If you ask me, we've been leaning on him for far too long. No projection, that time please. The curse took some of the weight off his shoulders, I reckon. Good night. Just don't tell Gav I said so, will you? I won't have him thinking he's been hard done by. Oof. Next thing you know, he'll be asking for a day off. <laughs> Charms would be a fine thing. Charms <sighs> would be a fine thing. <clears throat> Forgive me, Sid. This did not play out as I expected. <laughs> Things really do these days. But that's why we need men like Ember more than ever. Men who can make the best out of a bad situation. Remember that. I, I will, Sid. Hmm. Thank you. I don't use any of those. None whatsoever. <sighs> Let's go see the notes. Someone's writing me notes. Oh, Dion. I just had a weird thought. A Dion and Joshua scene would be interesting. <laughs> Although Joshua is straight, so whatever. The hell is that? I'm getting all sorts of shit here. Where's all this shit coming from? Cluttering my room? Oh, of course. Obviously that. Ah, chill. I only have four left? What the hell? My room is getting cluttered. Jill, do something about it. What's Clean my mind, room. Kai? Clean my room. Ask about memories. <laughs> what? For so long. So when this is over. Okay, they can't even bother with. Somewhere. In the back of my mind. They can't even bother, like, recording I these lines. I, I, then I can't Thank bother you. reading it. I kind of don't care. Right. Kind of don't care if you don't feel like voicing. Paying the fucking voice actors to read everything. I mean, I'll that's their job, this, ain't it? Lord. I shall go to East. <laughs> But, as soon as the but then they have these guys saying shit. It's like, that, that dude's not, Oscar's not a fucking main character. And you can't even bother to to pay all the main cast to read all of their lines? No, fuck off. Fuck off. You've got your priorities mixed up. You alright? But you ran out before the script. Yeah, I guess. That. that could be. It, it's just like. When the majority of the game is spoken and then all of a sudden you're like thrown with Oh, I actually have to read? It's like, oh, Hi. I kind of don't feel like it. <laughs> no, skip. Let's... Skip. 
kind of don't feel oops something troubling you what do you want it's just that this baby will be coming soon and oh, I wanted to make something for his it his new girl I'm sure she'd like that back in the north families would always make gifts when a Ben was on the way yeah I'll let the little tykes know they were welcome in their new homes like so what's the problem well, the problem is that Ed is due any day now and I don't know if I'll be ready in time oh Is there anything I can do to help? Hmm. You know, there just might be. All right, then. What exactly are we making? A good luck charm. But not just any good luck charm. Not just any. <laughs> no. One made from the feather of a silver chocobo. <laughs> There's not luck in all the realm, or so we used to say back home anyway. Thing is, they're hard to come by. Had Otto and Karen check with their suppliers, but nothing. I try and track one down myself, only. Only the big. What is his accent, fishing. by the way? And that's all you need. Is that, that more of a Scottish that accent? Or the bird whose arse it's attached to, I. I was gonna start by asking around with traveling. Ah, Ambrosia! Yeah, pluck my poor There's bird. There's no shortage of those passing through Martha's. I think I might make that my first port of call. I'll let you know if I find anything. You're a good friend, I'm, I'm getting more curious about the various this. accents and dialects for British accents. But his... his me is more Scottish than anything else. A bairn. That's not typical British English, is it? <coughs> like, my knowledge of British English is very limited to begin with, so I wouldn't really know. <clears throat> oh, that's a beast! A beast! Beast! Come here, my beast! Oh, hi! Oh, hi! Say hello! Uh, mm, uh, yeah? Mm. Uh, mm. What you want? I have no snack for you. All gone. All gone, snack. All gone. All gone. No more snack. Come in there. Yeah, brrra, brrra, brrra. The mice is here. Brrra. Ah. Say something more. Say something more. You will say, I'm here. <laughs> I love you. You're a good girl. I love you. Oh, what do you have to me? What do you have to me? What do you have to me? You can go. You can go. Yeah. Mm. Sweet beast. Northern? Oh, okay. Alright, alright. Okay. So it's. Okay. That's Doesn't necessarily have to be Scottish, but more northern. Excuse me. I'm looking for something. Oh, well, then I'm your man. <laughs> Traveling a traitor. Chocobo feather. You're a traitor! Oh, or maybe uh, not. Oh, I am by trade. Not the first to mention <laughs> the bird around here. Yeah. There was a man stopped by the rest <laughs> not long ago, cleaning and... You're a traitor! I am... I am by trade. <laughs> Most took him for a braggart and a liar. Don't but mind me. Who knows? I'm dumb. Perhaps there was some truth to his tale. We'll see. Oh God. Thank you. See, this is me like finally getting well and like having an, a a sheer like outspurt of energy. <laughs> it's like I'm being super dumb. You have to hungry. You have everything. You have everything. You do. Oh god, this is where we first like spotted Joshua Shoal. I remember this area. Ah, Sandy. So so then. 
sold it. I need to write a fanfic. I swear to God, I need to write a fan. <laughs> if I do, holy fuck. If I do, I want to release it for like the next komike. Uh, the last time I released anything was at like a summer komike a long time ago at a friend's booth. He released it for me. But I like printed shit and stuff, so it was a, it was a novel and it had some of my illustration artwork, but um nothing anything super fancy or anything like that but oh my god <gasps> should I should I try to make something for the next komike like um few komi for winter winter I might be able to do especially if I can use some of my time at work <gasps> if I could do that the bearers taking well to their new homes, you know. <coughs> I sometimes worry how they'll manage without me to cook and clean for them. Oh, boy. I can't talk to boy! Can I talk to Jill? If I can talk to Jill but not boy, I'll be so pissed. Alright. Can't talk to either of them. That's okay. Is it outside? Is it this dude? Hey, that dude. What? What? This is where it gets irritating when, like, it gets really, like, confusing. Who, who do I need to talk to? See? I've already, come on. You go in the building and he's not there. Then you go fucking out the building and then you went too far. Right? That's, like, seriously right here at the front. As a you torgle Fuck off! Get in the door! Get in the door, you freaking mutt! Huh? Yeah, December. So, 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 so. December, yo! December, yo! If I know somebody who has a booth, I might release something. Otherwise, it might be, like, more... I don't know, man. If I if I have a little bit of see, that's what I need. I need like a shove all the time because otherwise it's like I'm very slow to do anything. So if I have the slightest bit of a hey, y you said you were gonna do this, right? Hey, the deadline is blah blah, right? Hey, you realize what time it is? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I, I need that constant nagging. It's not necessarily nagging, but it helps me. I don't know how much. There's nothing fucking here! Silver linings! Are the bearers taking well to their new homes, you know? I don't fucking I know! Worry how they'll manage without me to cook and clean. I could care less! My lass? Huh? There ain't nothing here. There ain't nothing here. Behind? See, this is where I start to get annoyed. There ain't nothing here. See? Fuck off. Can I help you with summer? You wouldn't have to sell silver chocobo feathers, would you? <laughs> I deal in fruit, not fancies. But if it's fancies you're after, I suggest you try Rhiannon's ride. Was a silver chocobo seen there? Oh, yes. If you believe the ravens of a madman. It wouldn't be the first time. Now what? Speak with the merchants in Martha's Rest. <sighs> Come on. Give me a break. This is Martha's Rest. 
Yeah, I would like to formalize it a still new hurt, story. Because I have many ideas. It's just I'm very bad with, like, the execution part. Because I have very bad execution dysfunction. <laughs> it's very hard for me to, like, do anything. I need, I need, like, the, the constant prying of a barb in my back to, to do anything. What the fuck? Come on, what? What am I supposed to do? Speak with the merchants in Martha's Rest. Is this not fucking Martha's Rest? So I need to speak with the merchants? Oh, for fuck's sake. What? Guardians Are you a merchant? You ain't a merchant. Alright, fine. Ugh. Let's go talk to the item, dude. Far He's just enemies. behind me. Mind our barricades. Join us and our patrols. Just because the heavens have gone to wreck and ruin, it don't mean we have to. Oh, this person? How do, traveler? You've the look of a man who could do with a new whetstone. A whetstone? Or perhaps a bawdy etching of the vicerine. A what? Uh, Maybe another time. A what? I'm looking for a silver. What was that second thing? I the case. just literally Rumors did not understand are all what you're said. likely to find. No one has seen a silver chalk about for years. Word is they were all hunted for their feathers. Some northern nonsense about bringing good luck. <laughs> Didn't bring them much, nor their bows. If any are still out there, I reckon they'll be doing their damnedest not to be discovered. You're probably right. Also, women. I'm Thank very you anyway. Sorry. Please. A silver chocobo sighted oh, in the hills near Rhiannon Tride. It sounds the almost side. too good to be true. But. <sighs> since I'm already here. But since I'm already here. Where do I need to go? I think it would be faster just to go to East Pool and then go down. Yes, I have many ideas for a Grand Blue Fantasy story. It would be nice to finally put it to paper. Because that's my weakest point. I really have a hard time doing just that. And if I were to get a, a circle, right. I would have to, like, um, register now. It's probably too late, actually. <laughs> ah! Ah, 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 ah. I see it. <coughs> Tracks. For a change. We shall see. Eh? Co eh, mm mm? Coco de Atteru, so? Yamete? Kso. Eh? Burb feet? That's burb feet. More tracks. More burb feet. And these look fresh. Burb, 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 Perhaps it still is. The shop, the shop. <gasps> burb is hatching a a baby burb. Burb is trying to hatch. It's making a home. The shop. It's trying to make a home. I hear anything. That's because it's making a home. It's an egg. <gasps> well, I'll be damned. Lucifer. Lucifer. <gasps> Don't you dare to my feather. Piece of shit. That calls 1,805,000 measles. How dare you. Oh, but my burb. 
Oh, it's my burbs dana -sung. It's all right. I'm not going to hurt you. Just borrowing a feather for my friend. Uh, you gotta ask for permission before you take. Thank you. <sighs> Let's get this back to Gav before they change their minds. Yeah, couldn't I have just taken it from my burb? Why? Why did I? Why did I have to steal from some poor, unexpecting, chokeable couple? Ah, <laughs> uh, it's got it. It's got it. Mo, 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 mo. It was no trouble. There was no trouble. Oh, is that the, hey, the noob? Pack. How'd you get on? Any luck? Any luck, you say? That's our freaking noob. Oh. Hi, hi, hi. Take it. Hurry up and take it. Crystal's crack. Is this <laughs> what I think it is? Crystal's Where crack! How did you find it? What? It's a long story. Right there on the road to Eastpool. <laughs> Who'd have thought it? Everything up there's been abandoned for years. The empty cabin made for the perfect shelter. Though I fear my presence may have forced the poor creatures to look elsewhere. Don't blame yourself, Clive. The blight's right on Eastpool's doorstep. They'd have had to move on before long. Even if you hadn't have turned up, they'll find a new home. Trust me. After all, that's what us endangered animals do. Anyway, what matters is, you managed to nick us one of their quills before they could run off. And now all that's left is to fix it to the carving. I didn't know you could carve. Mm, reckon there's a lot you don't know about me. <laughs> so I'm as good with a whittling knife as I am with a sword. That was kind of awkward. That gave me a dream to work with. <coughs> what did you say it was from again? An Avis? But it weren't your Avis, Sid. Not my I Avis. I own at last. So all those long nights in the pit finally bore fruit. Oh. I'm proud of you, Ember. <laughs> Don't speak too soon. I ain't done my trial yet. There we go. Look at that dude. <laughs> oh. What do you think? I think if you ever hang up your scouting cap, you'll be able to make an honest living. Now will my I? Isn't it? <laughs> I should go and see if Ed is awake. Give him my best. Ow, oh, he's got yourself. a thing for poor Edda. Come on. He's in this guy. He's in this guy. Yeah, so she, she. Oh, Kazuka need nothing. Hi. I don't right, want Gav to give up being a scout, honest. Ah, uh, yes, you do. I don't suppose you're here to reprise the saint and the Trinity do you know Accord. why? I could care less. Your mother, the Duchess. What? Oh. Uh, but above all, Tuska. And so you. Hi 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 hi. That's my boy. That's my boy. Byron. Keep your opinions. I don't opinions want Gab to give up being a scout. Honest. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Eh? Kotsi. Ah, notes. Hey, hi. Ah, God. Hello, welcome. I'm just doing some menial work right now. And having a little bit of fun in the meanwhile. Oh my God! Look at all these messages I've got right now. Oh, young. Spare me. Oh, Joshua! Do you remember what you told me that night at Phoenix Gake? At Phoenix Gake. <laughs> that while the fate of Rosaria sits on my shoulders, the fate of its dominance sits upon yours. But are we not both dominance of fire? 
Does not the flame of our forebears both burn in our hearts? Should I not protect you as you have protected me? Oh, you have chosen to be my shield. Now let me choose to be yours. Oh, no! Is this not what our father wanted? What Sid wanted? To cast aside fate and forge our own paths. Grant me this, Clive. Let me be your strength. Oh, no! 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 I refuse! I refuse! If Joshua has to die because of me, I'm gonna be so fucking pissed! Don't tell me what happens! God damn it! No! Absolutely not! Oh, hooded man. My lord Marcus. Mar Marquise? I don't know how to say that word. I'm so tired of reading things. I write to thank you. Oh, God. I write to thank you for the kind consideration you have shown for those whose names are written within the pages of the Book of Martyrs. I know that it would move them deeply to know that the first shield of the Phoenix laments their passing. Though each and every member of our order stands ready to sacrifice their lives in service of the Phoenix, I do not doubt that those who are taken before their time go with regret. <sighs> it's so long-winded. <sighs> you can say this in less words. With regret for long years of duty left undone. That they should live on in the memory of the proud son of House Rossfield, such as yourself. Oh, I'm so tired. <laughs> Shall surely go some way to soothing their sorrows. May the phoenix's flame burn ever in your heart. Cyril, bear the burning quill. Yes, that is me. I'm so tired of reading shit. I'm not reading that now. Whole again. Vivian. That's nice. Sweet. Who are you? T yeah, uncle. Okay. Great. Oh, my dearest girl. <clears throat> it feels like a lifetime ago. It was a lifetime ago. That afternoon on Men's Hill was our very first adventure. But somehow I knew even then that it would not be our last. I will never forget that day. And the simple fact that you have not either fills my heart with joy. So fierce I cannot describe it. Ah, I'm burning for I burn for you! Since the moment we first met, you have always been an important part of me. The half that makes me whole. My bottom half! <laughs> when times are darkest, you are my light. When I am lost, you are my guiding star. You are just what I need. My bottom half! You are all that I need. You are the greatest gift. Hurry up and come to me! My boy. I'm so annoyed. <laughs> no! Shit. Read more letters, but I'm not gonna read them. No! Read more letters, but I'm not gonna read him. I'm not gonna read his letter. No. I shall not. I shall not! Hippocrates, what do you want? I'm aware there are matters of great, of much greater import which demand your attention. But should you find yourself a moment, I bid you visit me in the shelves that I might ask a single favor concerning his highness prince dion uh the old this me making demands of hippocrates so i wonder what this is about so my baby yep you know Getting bored and annoyed and agitated. So you need to tickle that little fancy whenever there is one. It's 
tickle it. Tickle, tickle my Osman Harpocrates. I received your note. Ah, yes. Ah, my dearest boy. I expect you're wondering what this is all about. <laughs> you might I spoke say that. of making amends with Dion. But I can't imagine what for. Uh, and I should begin by telling you that I was once Stop posting gorgeous photos of ago, Joshua. Of He's before I joined Sid in his hideaway. At that time, I was gonna say he's I a was boob. counted among the foremost scholars of Oriflame. <laughs> but that's a mix between babe and burb. To supervise <laughs> the young prince's education, all to ensure that the future emperor had a firm grounding in well, everything an emperor should. History, religion, commerce, government. Alas, our time together was cut short when Dion left to join the Dragoons. His study is no longer being deemed necessary. I had not expected to meet with him again, least of all here. Have you spoken with him? No, I... <laughs> I have yet to find the right moment. His Highness always seems so preoccupied. Especially when alone. I would not wish to disturb his ruminations with idle words of greeting. Not when I know he dwells upon the evil Ultima had him commit in the Dominion. The guilt weighs heavily on him, I know. But as you say, that was Ultima's doing. Surely you can't blame yourself. When I first met him, it was not guilt, but his people's expectations that weighed heavily upon him. And I did nothing to ease that burden. He bore it alone. Until the day he could not bear it any longer. It is one of my greatest regrets that I only ever offered him my wisdom when what he truly needed was friendship. The blame for Dion's transgressions lies not only on his shoulders, but on mine. I see. I'm ready to help you in any way that I can. Then I beg that you bring me a wild wyvern tale. <laughs> Apothecaries across the ages agree that even to glimpse such a flower is to be granted inner solace. Wyvern Fabulous is the correct pronunciation of, of that word, correct? But there is often seed of truth to be found. I learned it as wyvern. So opinions align. It's well, hard to, to unlearn. Where can I find that. this flower? And how will I know it? You have seen cultivated wyvern tales before, I trust. Wyvern. The lily white blossoms from whose roots the poisonous ink for the brand is distilled. Well, uh, those which grow in the wild so many only in their side purple hue. The harsher the environment in which they are raised, the deeper the colour. There is a waterfall in Rickmal's roost across the strait, where the flowers once grew in abundance. Whether they still survive there, I know not. But Try as I might, I can find no likelier location. It's all right. I'll find you a wise entail one way or another. <clears throat> Thank you, Clive. And please, be safe. Be safe. Dum 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 da dum 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 da dum in the infirmary. Why are we going to the infirmary? Da da dum 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 da dum 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 da dum da dum dum. Nani. A yote! Yote! Greetings, Lord Mark. Ah! Ah! Yote! Ask about origin. My lord. Ah, ask about Joshua! Ah. Wait! There's another. <laughs> And so is Joshua. 
I know you fear for him, but I'll do everything in my power to keep him safe. I do not doubt it. You are, as you have always been, his first shield. I was only ever temporary, his temporary protector. Now his grace has bade me protect the hideaway instead, and that is what I shall do. Thank oh you, Yote. Oh God. Oh May you return safely. I lost both of you. Oh, oh, oh! Just wait. Mo, ta, ta, ra, ni nai ka ni. His grace and I spoke upon our travels, and I certain saying, and a certain saying of his remains with me even now. Duty is the enemy of freedom. At first, I thought that he spoke of his own plight. That though he was able to roam the land again, his duty to unearth the truth upon about Altima prevented him from being truly free. But I came to understand that he spoke not of himself, but of me. It was my duty to him. That his grace judged to be a missile to my own freedom. I believe that this is why he bade me remain here, that I might be at last... Huh? Uh, that I might be at last be oh man that's must that I might at last be released from my duty to him oh no <sighs> few others in his position would allow the cares of a humble attendant to weigh so heavily upon them nor take such drastic action in response uh, is that the end fuck 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 of course, we all knew that, though. We all knew that. Care, my lord. We all knew that. Obviously. Oh, that's what's her name. She's gonna have her kid. Ah, me lords. Ah, me lords. Me feeling. Well. Me you. lords is a one word. Ah. Oh, is there's Gav. Something yep. wrong? Wrong? No, nothing like that. Uh, what it is is. Uh, Go on, please. Uh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. A ring. It's beautiful. Did you make it? We did. I. Uh, oh, we did. It's I, from mm. all of us here at the hideaway, your new family. Like, it's a good luck charm. <laughs> we may come up north when a bands on the way. I, I mean, B-A-I-R-N. know that they're part of the family, too. Oh, I, I, ho I hope you like it. From the Thank north, that makes sense. I don't know what to say. At I least they're keeping you, true to that. For it's everything. definitely a northern dialect. If there's anything you need, just let us know. I will. Oh, Clive, fancy a swift off. I'm thirsty. A swift half. <laughs> half pint? Is that what you're talking about? <laughs> I need a drink. Let's have a drink. A quick drink. A swift half. Interesting. Don't you think you've had enough? No, nope, we're nope. celebrating. I'm gonna be a father. Eh? <laughs> I think Edda might have something to say about that. Um, so, so, so. Ah, you know what I mean. Bit of light <laughs> in these dark times. <sighs> it wasn't long after me tenth name day, my mum told us she was with child again. I was over the fucking moon. Oh no. I was looking forward to having a little one to lord it over. What with me being the runt of the litter. I thought I'd finally have a chance to prove to the world that I could be a big brother. Oh no. Imperials came the day she went into labor. Had myself a baby sister. And then I didn't. Oh. My whole family gone in a blink. 
while I hid in the cellar like the spineless little arsehole I was. Oh. Great brother I turned out to be. I'll never be a leader. And I'll never be a hero. I'm just a daft little dog who comes running when his master calls. I'll never be like you, or Sid, or Jill, or even Toggle. <laughs> Have you finished? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> I love it. Are you finished? Do you know why? You're our best scout. Mm -hmm. Because you don't need anyone to hold your hand. Without your resourcefulness, your courage, your determination, I don't know where we'd be. Maybe hanging off a cliff like... Uh... That was only the once. Exactly. You learn from it, and here you are after founder knows how many missions stronger for everyone. Mm. <laughs> and let's not forget Rosalith. Mm. Who was it who freed me from the dungeon? Who was it who ran to Jill's rescue? Mm. That would be me. <laughs> because you're our brother, Gav. My brother. Oh. Your brother. <sighs> now Which spoken means lightly. That when the time comes. Oh. I get your room. And your sword. <laughs> Look at his ass. Look at the tight ass. Is <laughs> all I can see is the light shines directly upon it. <laughs> no, Joshua gets everything. Fuck off, Gav. We have had one too many. You may have had ten too many. <laughs> uh, I said I was thirsty. Gotta get back to work anyway. <sighs> After I walk this off. <laughs> uh, Clive? What is it? Thanks for, you know. I know. In it, in it, it's fun. It's a bleep. Curiosity. Winter mead! Yes, please! Can I have a taste of that? Displayed in. Oh, for fuck's sake, come on. I want some of that winter mead. Mead is delicious. If you've never had mead before in your entire life, what are you doing? Do you think they'll come back? Get some mead! Some authentic Irish mead. Bun ratty. Bun ratty mead is my favorite. It's so good. I order it periodically. I get it shipped to Japan. I have a bottle here in the room right now. That I mean the gift of a friend that I haven't been able to see yet. Oh my god. Oh my lord, we only have three left? Battle of fucking mead! Dear God! It's huge! Look at the thing. Northern territories. Yeah, see? See? His accent is more northern. I could hear it. I'm not an expert, but I could hear it. 
I'm getting really tired. Uh, let me take a really quick break and I'll be right back. One moment. One moment, please. One moment. Okay, I am back. I put some frozen food in the microwave. <laughs> so for the next five minutes that will be cooking. So I will have some yummy pasta. It's super yummy. Even if it's frozen, it's super yummy. It seriously is. Hi, what do I need to do? Ah. Uh. All right, let's see what... Ah, the skies. We need to go down this way. Say what you will. So it's can I do? There's an up and a down. Hoi, hoi, hoi. Hoi. Kai. 
Oh, this is my... This is not typically my, my way here, but... Oh well. <coughs> what? Did you think Children. To Miss Mid at all? What happened to Mid? Sid! You have to help us! <sighs> With what? You didn't take a part in another of Mid's contraptions, did you? No. Well, yes. But that's not what we want to talk to you about. It's Miss Mid at all. She's been acting strange. Very strange. She's barely ever around. When she is, she acts like we aren't even there. Her head's in a crowd. In the clouds. And that's what I said. In the clouds. Well, she does have a lot on her mind. When did you last see her? Um, not long ago. Ah, right after she got back from saving me from Stone Ear. Then it's probably just about the Enterprise. It did take quite a battering on the way there and back. You didn't break it, did you, Sid? You really should be more careful around Miss Mididol's uh, inventions. Oh, don't listen to her. Even if you did break the Enterprise, you could break <laughs> I it. I mean to break. But no, I haven't opened the bottle. All back together. It's for my she friend. She's really sad. <clears throat> Why don't I go and see if I can cheer I'm her up? I'm still keeping it. You do that for us. It won't she go bad. So don't, no worries. Don't scare him. It's not a real dungeon. Thanks for the warning. Oh. Now what? Hi? We need to go downstairs. See what the fuck Mid's doing. Mid, what are you doing? Mid, what are you doing in the dungeons? What are you doing? Mid, if you have a... Ah! <laughs> That's it! I knew it! The answer was right here under my ass all along! Oh my god. If this doesn't see it to the skies, nothing will. To the skies. Hey. You aren't trying to give the Enterprise wings, are you? Oh, yes, she is. What yes, she is. Yes, she the children is. Seem to think you're avoiding them. They're worried about you. Is this give them really wings. So important that you need to Mid. shut yourself away from everyone. The Enterprise is already the fastest ship in the realm, and mm. that's with the sea beneath her. Mm. But what if she weren't bound to the waves? Yes. What if she weren't bound to anything at all? Yes. It's not fair. The gods get the skies all to themselves, so Exactly. I'm gonna do something about it. Mm. The fallen had their chance, but they relied too much on magic. And see where that got them. But not me. I've discovered how to do it without. Well, almost. Oh First serious? Time, There's a store in Seattle. And is that it a has one woman a... job? Ooh. Are you volunteering? Highly I'll recommend. The Enterprise is my baby. I get it directly from well, the the place in Ireland. So. Hand, I'd be happy to take it. I mean, it's not cheap or anything, but first I'll need oil. It's actually and not, not bad. It's it's relatively okay. Refined stuff like they're making all dill. For what you then get. I'll need some bone or shell. So right. definitely, if you haven't Strong, had no longer attached need to before, to. it's definitely a, an experience. After. I'm sure the curse breakers <laughs> will know where you might find some. It's honey no, based. They'll know where you might find some. You're and the it, one who offered to it, help, it. remember? It's tradition in I Ireland, speak with so. The curse breakers before I set off for Old Hill. In that See area, it, it's kind I'm of well. part of the culture. Who oh, the shit is around the other end of the kiln? Can I. Uh, who is on the other end of the kiln? Nobody. <coughs> Nobody is on the other end of the kiln. Well, who the fuck am I supposed to talk to then? Has Mitterdoll mentioned a new project yet? I couldn't tell you. Read the books. And unread the books. Whatever should I write next? Couldn't tell you. A novel. Eh? Nani? Mo ya da kore. Koyu koyu no ga hontou ni ya nan da yo. Naka chizu ni mark ga atte mo toroke nai nda yo. Ue? 
だから知らないし知らないんだよ上と下か知らないんだよだから区別してないんだからさ区別してよちゃんと Oh my god Oh my god Make me walk really super slow See Sid What? May I have a moment? What do you want, Herman? It is an honor <laughs> to finally speak with you. My name is Herman. I've been with the Curse Breakers for some time now. And uh, I wish to be deployed to Ash. Oh, okay. Yeah. See, Any Mead is, mead is wondrous. Well, the lands I across the quite are enjoy dangerous. the Mead. I will not send good men and women to risk their lives needlessly. Why would you want to go back? I need to retrieve something. Something important. I was raised in an orphanage. The Badbach Conservatory. Or rather... Bad was Bach. Bad Batch? It existed solely the to Bad Batch! Into As an orphanage. Weapons. Oh my god. We torture, <laughs> until we feared no pain. Can you imagine that? Tormented until our hearts Orphanage. Turned bad Batch. And few ever survived long enough to become tools of the last king. I uh, can't imagine. I can't imagine. I lost so many. Shit. I don't have enough empty bottles I right here. Even remember empty all cans. Names. Too many. But they Too must many be empty remembered. cans. That, that was nice. They cannot fade away. Faces that one. And forgotten. The institute was run with military precision. Every child measured, every name recorded, every death logged. Yes, 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 it is. Sid, Sad endeavor. I'm gonna walk away for a minute because they're just gonna to keep Ash talking and talking. And recover the registry so that my brothers and sisters might live on. Oh, finally have a decision. No, I'll go instead. You were a good friend, Herman. Herman. But the fact remains that Ash is simply too dangerous. I have pasta. Sid, please. Even I'm going to mute myself because my otherwise you're going to hear slurping. <laughs> Stuff like that. But not for me. So, let me mute I'll myself. I'll go to Badbach and find the registry. You will? I won't let you risk your life. I don't know how to thank you. You can start by telling me where I'll find this orphanage. Lead a grace. Hidden in a forest. Overlooking the plains. All right. I'll see what I can find there. May the mothers guide you.
Let's go. Fly, Ambrosia. This must be the orphanage. Hopefully the registry is still here. Disposed of. Conditioning. This is nothing short of torture. Herman wasn't exaggerating. It's a wonder he survived this place. I need to find that registry. This reads like a suicide note. Did the director go through with his plan? There's only one way. 
way to find out. Okay, I'm done eating my yummy pasta. It was very good. Yummy, yummy pasta. But I'm still very confused with this map. Do I need to go out this way? Is that the way I'm meant to go? Yes, it is. Then I shall go out this way. That is correct. Out that way. Oh my god. Alright. So kind of sort of go straight. Oof. Right into the cemetery. Not where I would very much like to go. Well, that's where it's the leading. Fort White Tree. This must be the place. The Fort White Tree. That's a birch. It's a birch tree. Could he really be buried here? Sa. There's something hidden among the roots. Let's see. Uh. You would like to dig up somebody's remains, Disco. This must be the registry. Ten years old, nine, twelve, ten. Uh, lith, lith, lithication. Lithication. What the fuck is that? There are kids. So many Shit. names. What the fuck? This place was a slaughterhouse. Mm-hmm. And where is the architect of all this misery? Mm -hmm. Threatening growls. It was only a matter of time, I suppose. Hi. Ah, oh, lass. Ashes to ashes. This place is cursed. Every day. Oh, is that what that means? They were turned to stone? Oh, that sucks. <laughs> I'm done here. Let's get the registry. If back that's the, the case, the man, it would have been nice to see some like human shaped stone figures. <laughs> Nothing, nothing else to be seen here. What, what? Enceladus? Hand of Enceladus is what? Get him out. Oh my god.
I do remember coming this way though. done any of them. Is it really important to do those? I haven't done any of them. Oh! Hello! This is uh, number three. Ma, 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 ma. Either. Let's see something here. Uh, there are too many quests. Uh, makes me sleepy. I would very much like to take a nap. Hmm. Not a die Ah, maybe let's save. Because I don't think we saved for a while. It was at 10 o'clock. <coughs> Hi. Run! Run, my boy, run! Kinda funny. Dun 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 dun. I very vaguely remember this area. Super marshy area. Lots of Kashik animals. Whoa! Where did I? Oh, did you hit me? Did you actually hit me? You piece of shit. Fuck off. Hmm? Seems this place has been flooded twice over. So no no. So no no no. Oh, 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 oh. It's one of those guys. Let's see. What's it? Eh, that kill saw. I too. Chotomate, chotomate, chotomate. I kind of feel like that's something over there. Let me find out. If I'm wrong, we shall reset. Yeah! 
that was nothing. That was just an ordinary dude doing his thing. Sanenagara. Let's grab Local that. Flowers item. blooming next to a waterfall. Shouldn't be too hard to find. Aw. Aw. Soitsunokai. Soitsu? Just not there. Soitsu, the show. Soitsu, not there. So. <laughs> oh, I mean, he's kind of in the way, but. Is. Let's pick up wild wyvern tail. <laughs> what was that just now? <laughs> He's like, where to go? Where to go? Where to go? <laughs> I've got curl butt in my eyes. <laughs> curl butt out of my way. <laughs> You're getting me confused. Way. Way of fine, but what? So I'm done here. I guess I'm done here. <laughs> that was turned to stone. Oh, interesting. Hi, hi, hi. Oh man, that gave me the giggles there for a minute. <laughs> around and around he went. He's like, oh, I'm confused with this butt in my face. Ah, I don't know what to pick up. <laughs> which, which is it? I don't know. I'm so confused. There's something about it. Litany of errors. Is it? Uh, is it this dude? No, that's two. Fuck off. No, I ain't doing you yet. No, not yet. We're going down. <laughs> he got distracted. <laughs> yeah. Suffice it to say. That is indeed what happened. Huh? Ah, well then, not the this one, eh? Hi, hi, hi. Stop. I'm still hungry. This is bad. This is a bad. Huh? Doggo. What the fuck? What the fuck? God. I hate this so much. Where the fuck are you? Where are you, Devin, you piece of shit? This? You're up. Love story, Maybe tell me. Mm. This is the worst. Like literal level design is annoying. Tell me if you're down. Tell me if you're I below. That, you that might help. Ash. Sid, did you by any uh. chance recover the names of my fallen friends? I Indeed, did. I did. Yes. If I may, 
please. The bearer registry. The director was a brutal man. He got no worse than he deserved. The registry was all I found beneath the tree. There was no sign of a body. I need to start cleaning out the record of what the happened fridge, to the children after because the, the freezer closed. is like literally freezing itself some of them survived. I can't put anything in it because it's all ice. <laughs> the ones we lost, my friends. I think it froze too much, and then I can't in those dark times. reach the controls, so it, can it's probably super faces. freezing everything. <laughs> it was yesterday. It's kind of nuts. Children who were taken from their bunks in the morning. Never to return. No explanation ever offered. They'd I think I ate everything. Survived, Herman. So, but why did I make it out alive? Attempt it. When so many others died in that awful place. It's not your fault. <clears throat> and blaming yourself won't bring them back. Out of their memory. Or their See that their names live yes, on. Yes. 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 That way, at least. At this gone. point, I'm kind of losing interest. Thank you, Sid. I'm going to so write a book. Name. Stop calling me An that. account of the horrors of Badbach and the spirit of those its custodians sought to crush. All of Valistia will know of that. our suffering. And in the name of those I lost, I will not let it happen again. Neither will I. These records would have been buried for all eternity, were it not for you. <laughs> Thank you. Mesmerize the breath of ice. I don't use any of those. Look at this cute little pot. This pot with pretty flowers coming out of it. That's very nice. <gasps> pretty flowers. Those are irises. What are those? Looks kind of like irises to me. But I wouldn't know. What's going on down there? What the fuck? Uh, more. More. I want more food. I want more food. Would it be bad if I went down to the store again to get more food? Ah, uh, just look. Mm. Would it be bad at least? So that was super good. They just recently got more like frozen food. All right, Sid. So come to buy us around, have you? I have. Well, if you earn it. <laughs> Mid needs a piece of light but durable bone for her next project. Give me some of you your bone. You piece on your travels across the realm. Any ideas? Most bones are the same. Whack them hard enough and they'll break. If it's durability you're looking for, shell will serve you better. You know what an adamantus is? I do. And I know to give them a wide berth. Will any old adamantus do? Well, with shells, the older the harder. 
There's a rumor of an ancient Adamantus down in Carava, near Umbidza, all that's left of the village anyway. But don't expect to make quick work of the bastard. There's a reason it's lived as long as it has. Do you know? Keep that in mind. Thank you. 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 So I'm thinking I might take a break and just go down to the store again. It's late, but it is what it is. It is what it is. I might get more food. Crap. I didn't want to go out again, but I kind of, I'm, I'm kind of feeling ganky right now, which is weird at 10:30 at night. <laughs> I'm feeling a little bit energetic, so I do. Kind of feel like I need to walk around. Maybe I'll go next door to the park. It's super creepy at night, but. My nose isn't all that sniffly as it has been. <coughs> and I feel like my cough is kind of, for the most part, gone away. I don't know, maybe it's just because I haven't been talking in the past four days. <laughs> this is the first time that I've been talking at all. In four days, at least. So, let me let me save. I'll take a quick break. No, I'll, I'll take a longer break, because I want to stop the stream. Because, have I been streaming for four hours? Is that correct? What the fuck? It does not feel like that, but okay, it is what it is. So I shall put that on pause. A game shall sit like that. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I don't, uh, man, I don't know what real life is, seriously. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Today was a day off, so yeah. I took today off because it's part of like, my summer vacation, so I already had today off. So I have the rest of the week off for summer vacation. Thankfully, it just sucks because I'm half sick for... I'm sick for half of it, basically. This past weekend was also part of my vacation, but obviously I was mostly sleeping. <sighs> <sighs> Alright, so let me go out, <clears throat> try to be somewhat energetic and get some more food, and then I'll be back. Because I do want, mm, I don't want to buy a whole lot though, because I want to thaw out my, my fridge for the first time in 10 years, probably. <laughs> Hi. So I shall be back in about probably 30 minutes or so, around then. So around 11 o'clock my time. I should be back. So until then, have a good one. So long and farewell. I shall return. Goodbye. Bye-bye. <laughs>